ശ്രീമതി ശാന്ത പോൾ ദയവായി വേദിയിലേക്ക് എത്തണമെന്ന് റിക്വസ്റ്റ് ചെയ്യുന്നു ശ്രീമതി ശാന്ത പോൾ ശ്രീമതി രശ്മി വിനേഷ് ശ്രീമതി നസീല ശ്രീമതി ആശാ ചാൾസ് ശ്രീമതി ഉഷാ സരൽ ശ്രീമതി ജയലക്ഷ്മി പ്രകാശ് ആൻഡ് ശ്രീമതി സോണി ലാൽ എന്നിവരെ ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു Thank <laughs> you. 
May I invite Global Chairman Sri Joni Kuruvela for the inaugural speech. In the present present, the Global Chairman Sri Joni Kuruvela. The definition is your name.
സദസ്സിനെ അഭിസംബോധന ചെയ്ത് സംസാരിക്കുന്നതിനായി ഗ്ലോബൽ വിമൻസ് ഫോറം പ്രസിഡന്റ് ശ്രീമതി ജാനക് വർഗീസിനെ ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു ഗ്ലോബൽ വിമൻസ് ഫോറം പ്രസിഡന്റ് മിസ് ജാനക് വർഗീസ് ഫോർ ദി പ്രസിഡന്റ് സർജറീസ് എല്ലാവർക്കും നമസ്കാരം വീണ്ടും മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ വുമൺസ് ഫോറം ഇങ്ങനെ ഒരു പ്രോഗ്രാം ഇവിടെ നടത്തിയതിന് പ്രത്യേകിച്ച് എസ് കെ റൈസക്കിനെ പ്രത്യേകം ആദ്യമായി തന്നെ അഭിനന്ദനങ്ങൾ അറിയിക്കുന്നു പിന്നെ ഗ്ലോബൽ ചെയർമാൻ ജോണി പിന്നോളയ്ക്കും ഗ്ലോബൽ ട്രഷർ എ ജെയിംസ് കൂടലിനും പ്രത്യേകം അഭിനന്ദനങ്ങൾ മറ്റു ഗ്ലോബൽ ഭാരവാഹികളെ പ്രോവിൻസ് റീജിയണൽ ഭാരവാഹികളെ എല്ലാവർക്കും ഇവിടെ എത്തിയിരിക്കുന്ന എൻ്റെ എൻ്റെ വുമൻസ് ഫോറം വരെ എല്ലാവർക്കും സ്വാഗതം ഇങ്ങനെ ഒരു പരിപാടി നടത്തിയത് ഇങ്ങനെ അത്രയും മനോഹരമായ ഒരു പരിപാടി നടത്തുന്നതിൽ ഞാൻ വളരെ അഭിമാനം കൊള്ളുന്നു എൻ്റെ ഒരു റീജിയണലിൽ ഇങ്ങനെ ഒരു പരിപാടി നടത്താൻ സാധിച്ചതിൽ വളരെയധികം സന്തോഷമുണ്ട് മറ്റു പ്രൊവിൻസുകളുടെയും എല്ലാവരും നന്നായിട്ട് പ്രവർത്തിക്കുന്നുണ്ട് പ്രത്യേകിച്ച് പറയാനായിട്ട് എല്ലാ എല്ലാ പ്രൊവിൻസുകളിൽ നിന്നും ഭക്താക്കന്മാരും പെൺ ഭാര്യമാരെ ഇതിലേക്ക് പ്രവർത്തി വിടണം എന്ന് ഞാൻ പറയും പറയുന്നു എന്ന് വെച്ചാൽ കുറച്ച് പ്രൊവിൻസുകളിൽ ഭാര്യമാരെ പുറത്തേക്ക് കൊണ്ടുവരുന്നില്ല അതിന് നിങ്ങളുടെ എല്ലാം സഹായം ആവശ്യമുണ്ട് വേറെ പ്രത്യേകിച്ചൊന്നും പറയാനില്ല ഇങ്ങനെ ഒരു പരിപാടി നടത്തിയതിന് എല്ലാവർക്കും നന്ദി പറയുന്നു എല്ലാവരോടും ഇനിയും സഹകരണം ആവശ്യമുണ്ട് ഗ്ലോബൽ തലത്തിൽ രണ്ടു വർഷമായി നല്ല പരിപാടികൾ നടത്തിക്കൊണ്ടിരിക്കുന്നു നടത്തിക്കൊണ്ടിരിക്കുന്നു അതിന് വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിൻ്റെ പ്രാതിനിധ്യമാണ് കൂടുതൽ അപ്പം നിങ്ങൾ അതനുസരിച്ച് ഞങ്ങളോട് സഹകരിക്കണം മെയിൻ ഫോറം കാര്യം ഇത്രയും പറഞ്ഞുകൊണ്ട് നിൽക്കുന്നു എല്ലാവരുടെ സഹകരണം ഇനിയും പ്രതീക്ഷിക്കുന്നു ഞങ്ങളൊക്കെ വയസ്സന്മാരായി ഇനി ചെറുപ്പക്കാർ പുറത്തേക്ക് വരെ വരണം അതിനു വേണ്ടിയിട്ടാണ് മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റിൽ കുറച്ചും കൂടി പ്രൊവിൻസുകൾ പുറത്തേക്ക് വരാനുണ്ട് പ്രത്യേകിച്ച് അല്ലാത്തതിലും ഭാര്യമാരെ കൂടി കൊണ്ടുവരണമെന്ന് പ്രത്യേകിച്ച് ഭാര്യമാരെ പുറത്തേക്ക് വിടണമെന്ന് നിങ്ങളോട് അപേക്ഷിക്കുകയാണ് ഓക്കെ താങ്ക് യു താങ്ക് യു സോ മച്ച് അടുത്തതായിട്ട് ആശംസ അറിയിക്കുന്നതിനായി ഗ്ലോബൽ അഡ്വൈസറി ബോർഡ് ചെയർമാൻ ഡോക്ടർ ഐസക് ജോൺ പെട്ടാനി പറമ്പലിനെ വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു എല്ലാവർക്കും ഞാൻ എൻ്റെ പേരിൽ സ്വാഗതം ചെയ്യുകയാണ് ഇന്ന് വളരെ നമ്മുടെ ദേശീയ ദിനം യു എ ഡേ നമ്മുടെ ഹോസ്റ്റ് കൺട്രിയായ യു എ ഡേ ദേശീയ ദിനം പ്രൗഢഗംഭീരമായിട്ട് നമ്മൾ ആഘോഷിക്കുകയാണ് അതിൻ്റെ ആദ്യത്തെ രണ്ടാമത്തെ പാദമാണിത് മൂന്നാമത്തെ പാദം ഏഴ് മണി മുതൽ തുടങ്ങിയാണ് വളരെ കളർഫുള്ളായിട്ടുള്ള ഒരു കൾച്ചറൽ നൈ കൾച്ചറൽ ആൻഡ് അവാർഡ്സ് നൈറ്റാണ് വൈകുന്നേരത്തെ ഏഴ് മണി മുതലുള്ളത് എല്ലാവരും അതിലും പങ്കെടുത്ത് പ്രോഗ്രാം വിജയിപ്പിക്കണം നമ്മുടെ ഹോസ്റ്റ് രാജ്യത്തോടുള്ള നമ്മുടെ കമ്മിറ്റ്മെൻറ്റ് നമുക്ക് നമ്മുടെയൊക്കെ ഉയർച്ചയിലേക്ക് നയിക്കുവാനും നമ്മുടെയൊക്കെ ജീവിതത്തിൽ ഒരു പുതിയ വഴിത്തിരി ഉണ്ടാക്കുവാനും കഴിഞ്ഞ ലോകത്തിലെ ഏറ്റവും മനോഹരമായ ഒരു രാജ്യമാണ് യു എ അതിൻ്റെ ദേശീയ ദിനം നമ്മൾ സമുചിതമായിട്ട് ആചരിക്കും അതിനുവേണ്ടി വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ വിമൻസ് ഫോറം മുന്നോട്ട് വന്നതിൽ ഞാൻ അവരെ അനുമോദിക്കുകയാണ് നേരത്തെ ഇവിടെ ഉള്ള ടോണിയൊക്കെ സൂചിപ്പിച്ച പോലെ ഒരു സ്ത്രീ ശാക്തീകരണത്തിൻ്റെ ഒരു പുതിയൊരു കാലഘട്ടത്തിലേക്ക് നമ്മൾ കടക്കുമ്പോൾ വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിലും അതിനൊപ്പം ചലിക്കുന്നു ചലനാത്മകം ആവുന്നു എന്നുള്ളതിൻ്റെ തെളിവാണ് ഇത്ര ബഹുത്തായ രീതിയിൽ ഇവർക്ക് ഇത് കൊടുക്കാൻ കഴിഞ്ഞത് ഇനി ഇവിടെ കൊണ്ട് ഇതൊരു തുടക്കമാകട്ടെ ഇതിനും അതിഗംഭീരമായ പ്രോഗ്രാമുകൾ അടുത്ത വർഷവും അതിനടുത്ത വർഷവും നടത്താനായിട്ട് നിങ്ങൾക്ക് സാധിക്കട്ടെ എന്ന് ആശംസിക്കുന്നു നമ്മുടെ വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൺസ കുടുംബം അതിബഹത്താണ് സൂര്യൻ അസ്തമിക്കാത്ത ഒരു പ്രസ്ഥാനമാണ് ഇന്ന് ഓസ്ട്രേലിയയിൽ വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ സിഡ്നിയിൽ നമ്മുടെ ഒരു മെമ്പർ ഉണരുമ്പോൾ അമേരിക്കയിലുള്ള നമ്മുടെ ആൾക്കാർ ഉറങ്ങിയിരിക്കും അവർ ഉണരുമ്പോൾ ഇവർ ഇവിടെ ഉറങ്ങിയിരിക്കും അതായത് ഒരിക്കലും ഞങ്ങളുടെ രാജ്യത്ത് നമ്മുടെ ഞങ്ങളുടെ ഈ സംഘടനയിൽ സൂര്യൻ അസ്തമിക്കാറില്ല അതാണ് വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിലിൻ്റെ ശക്തിയും അതാണ് വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിലിൻ്റെ പ്രചോദനം അത് കൂടുതൽ ആൾക്കാരെ മുന്നോട്ട് കൊണ്ടുവരാൻ ഞാൻ കൂടുതൽ പ്രതിപിക്കുന്നില്ല മനോഹരമായ ഒരു സായാഹ്നം നിങ്ങൾക്ക് നിങ്ങളുടെ മുമ്പിലുണ്ട് എല്ലാ ആശംസകളും നേർന്നുകൊണ്ട് എൻ്റെ വാക്കോട് ചുരുക്കുന്നു ജെയ് വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ 
ready alle neengal ready alle all right valare confidence odu kodi ready aaga ennu parna nammude contestants okke idu nikkunnundu adinu munpayittu avarku oru energy kooti kodukkan vendittu nammude chenda team ready aayittu nikkunnundu
this. Hello, 
Thank you very much. Continue to number four.
നിന്നും ഈ മഹാനഗരത്തിലേക്ക് ചേക്കേറിയ ഒരു മലയാളി പ്രവാസി ഇഷ്ടവിനോദം ഡാൻസ് അതുകൊണ്ട് പഠിച്ചിട്ടില്ലെങ്കിലും എവിടെ ഒരു അവസരം കിട്ടിയാലും രണ്ട് ചൂട് വെക്കാൻ ഏറെ ഇഷ്ടപ്പെടുന്നൊരു വ്യക്തി അച്ഛനും അമ്മയും അനിയനും അടങ്ങുന്ന ഒരു ചെറിയ കുടുംബമാണ് എൻ്റെത് ജീവിതം ജയിക്കാനുള്ളതാണ് എന്നാൽ ആ വിജയം മറ്റുള്ളവരെ തോൽപ്പിക്കാൻ ആകരുത് എന്ന് ഏറ്റവും വലിയ ശക്തി എന്ന് ഞാൻ വിശ്വസിക്കുന്നത് തോറ്റുകൊടുക്കാൻ മനസ്സില്ലാത്ത എൻ്റെ മനസ്സാണ് എന്നാൽ അത് തന്നെയാണ് ഇന്നിവിടെ നിങ്ങളുടെ മുന്നിൽ എന്നെ നിൽക്കാൻ പ്രാപ്തിയാക്കിയത് നന്ദി നമസ്കാരം
and I'm 19 years of age. In Kerala, I'm from Trivandrum. I'm a second year engineering student pursuing artificial intelligence and machine learning and a professional singer who has received training in Carnatic music for over 13 years. I was interested in broadening my interests and trying out new things and I felt like fashion is a really good choice for this. And I saw this platform and wanted to seize this chance to challenge myself as to how far I can go. I would like to thank WMC for giving me this opportunity and to everyone present here. Thank you so much and have a wonderful evening ahead. Thank you. Hakshay, this new year, 
ആറായിരം അടി പാരഗ്ലൈഡിങ് ചെയ്ത് ഐ കോൺകോട്ട് മൈ ഫിയർ അതിൻ്റെ ഭാഗമായി ഞാനിതാ നിങ്ങളുടെ മുന്നിൽ ധൈര്യത്തോടെ എല്ലാവർക്കും പ്രചോദനമായി അഭിമാനത്തോടെ താങ്ക് യു ശ്രീമതി 
റാണി രണ്ടുപേരെയും വേദി ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു ആദ്യമായി ഇൻവൈറ്റിംഗ് മിസ് മർവ എൽഹെ മിസ് മർവ ഒരു നിറഞ്ഞ കായടി ും 
And the stage is all yours, Rashmi.
നിഹാൽ നസീർ എന്ന് പരിചയപ്പെടുത്തുവാൻ ഒരുപാട് സന്തോഷമുണ്ട് നിഹാൽ ഒരുപാട് സവിശേഷതകളുള്ള ഒരു കുട്ടിയാണ് ഞാൻ ഏറെ സ്നേഹിക്കുന്ന എൻ്റെ നസീർ കായുടെ മകനാണ് നിഹാൽ നിഹാൽ കീബോർഡിൽ സംഗീതം സൃഷ്ടിക്കുമ്പോൾ പിയാനോയിൽ സംഗീതം സൃഷ്ടിക്കുമ്പോൾ അതിന് ഒരുപാട് പ്രത്യേകതകളുണ്ട് ഭിന്നശേഷിയുള്ള ഒരു കുട്ടി നോട്ട്സ് നോക്കിക്കൊണ്ട് സംഗീതം സൃഷ്ടിക്കുന്നത് ഞാൻ ആദ്യമായിട്ടാണ് കാണുന്നത് ഓഡിയൻസ് കൊടുക്കുന്ന കയ്യടിയാണ് അവൻ്റെ പ്രചോദനം ഓഡിയൻസിൻ്റെ മുമ്പിൽ അവതരിപ്പിക്കുന്ന സമയത്ത് അവന് കിട്ടുന്ന ഊർജമാണ് അവൻ്റെ മുന്നോട്ടുള്ള യാത്രയ്ക്ക് പ്രചോദനമാവുന്നത് എല്ലാവരുടെയും അനുഗ്രഹാശിച്ചകൾ നിഹാലിന് ഉണ്ടാവണം എന്ന പ്രതികരണം വളരെയധികം അഭിമാനത്തോടു കൂടി അതിലേറെ സന്തോഷത്തോടു കൂടി നിഹാലിനെ നിങ്ങളുടെ മുമ്പിൽ അവതരിപ്പിക്കുന്നു നന്ദി നമസ്കാരം ഒരു നിറഞ്ഞ കൈയടി പതിനെട്ട് മുതൽ ഇത്രയും നാളായിട്ട് ഒരുപാട് പ്രസ്റ്റീജിയസ് ആയിട്ടുള്ള ഷോസ് ഓൾറെഡി നിഹാൽ ചെയ്തു കഴിഞ്ഞു ഒരുപാട് വേദികൾ പെർഫോം ചെയ്ത് കഴിഞ്ഞു തന്റെ വിരലുകളിൽ മാജിക് ഉള്ള ഒരു വ്യക്തിയാണ് തീർച്ചയായിട്ടും നിഹാൽ
teacher, Sri Benny Bessie George. So they are going to do Thank you so much, Nihal and Mr. Benny Bessie.
നമ്മുടെ ഈ വേദിയിലേക്ക് നമ്മുടെ ഈ ഒരു പ്രോഗ്രാമിലേക്ക് വളരെ അപ്രതീക്ഷിതമായി കടന്നു വന്ന ഒരു വിശിഷ്ട വ്യക്തിയെ വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കുകയാണ് ഇദ്ദേഹം ഒരു മ്യൂസീഷ്യൻ ആണ് ദാസേട്ടിന്റെ ശിഷ്യനാണ് നമ്മുടെ ചേതന ഇൻസ്റ്റിറ്റ്യൂട്ട് ഓഫ് തൃശൂർ ചേതന ഇൻസ്റ്റിറ്റ്യൂട്ടിന്റെ ഡയറക്ടർ ആണ് ലേഡീസ് ആൻഡ് ജെന്റർ ലെറ്റ്സ് വെൽക്കം ഫാദർ പോൾ പൂവതിങ്ങൾ ഒരു ഹ്യൂജ് റൗണ്ട് ഓഫ് അപ്ലോസ് അദ്ദേഹത്തെ ആദരപൂർവ്വം വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു ഫാദർ പോൾ പൂവതിങ്ങൾ അദ്ദേഹം നമ്മൾ ഒരു ഗാനം ആലപിക്കാം എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞ് ഏറ്റിട്ടുണ്ട് എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞിട്ടുണ്ട് അദ്ദേഹത്തിനെ സ്നേഹപൂർവ്വം വേദിയിലേക്ക് സ്വാഗതം ചെയ്യുന്നു Thank you. 
ആദ്യത്തെ റൗണ്ടിലൂടെ അവസാനിപ്പിക്കുകയാണ് ഓഷിന്റെ സെക്കൻഡ് റൗണ്ട് സാരി ഷോ സെക്കൻഡ് റൗണ്ടിലേക്ക് കിടക്കുന്നു
choreographer, stylist and model.
സംസാരിക്കുന്നതിനും രണ്ട് വാക്ക് സംസാരിക്കുന്നതിനുമായി ശ്രീ ജെയിംസ് കോഡ് നമ്മുടെ ഗ്ലോബൽ ട്രഷറർ ആണ് അദ്ദേഹത്തിന്റെ വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു ഹി കെയിം ഓൾ ദ വേ ഫ്രം ഹ്യൂസ്റ്റൺ അമേരിക്ക ladies and gentlemen let's welcome mr james kuda global treasurer with a huge round of applause per nerade kind of dude swagatham cheyam shri james kuda global treasurer ഏറ്റവും ആദരണീയനായ മലയാളികളുടെ അഹങ്കാരവുമായ ശ്രീ അടൂർ ഗോപാലകൃഷ്ണൻ ബാക്കി ഗ്ലോബൽ റീജിയണൽ പ്രൊവിൻഷ്യൽ ഭാരവാഹികളെ വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മെഡിലിസ്റ്റ് റീജിയനെ സംബന്ധിച്ചിടത്തോളം വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിലിനെ സംബന്ധിച്ചിടത്തോളം വളരെ അഭിമാനമുള്ള ഒരു നിമിഷങ്ങളിലൂടെയാണ് കടന്നു പോയിക്കൊണ്ടിരിക്കുന്നത് നമ്മുടെ സ്വന്തം സഹോദരന്മാർ വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മെഡിലിസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെ വിമൻസ് ഫോറം നടത്തുന്ന ഈ അതിമനോഹരമായ പ്രോഗ്രാം ആണ് കാണാനായിട്ട് ആളുകൾ കുറച്ചധികം പേര് കൂടി വേണമായിരുന്നു വളരെ മനോഹരമായിട്ട് കുറെ ദിവസങ്ങളായി വളരെ കഷ്ടപ്പെട്ട് അവർ അണിയിച്ചൊരുക്കിയിരിക്കുന്ന ഈ ഒരു അതിമനോഹരമായ പ്രോഗ്രാം അവരെ ഏറെ അഭിനന്ദിക്കാനായിട്ട് ഞാൻ ഈ അവസരം വിനിയോഗിക്കുന്നു അതിനകത്ത് ഏറ്റവും വലിയൊരു പ്രത്യേകത എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാൽ നമ്മൾ സ്ത്രീ ശാക്തീകരണത്തെ കുറിച്ച് പറയുക മാത്രമേ ചെയ്യുള്ളൂ പലരും അതിനുവേണ്ടി പ്രവർത്തിക്കാറില്ല പക്ഷേ ഇന്ന് ഇവിടെ വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ സ്ത്രീജിയനുള്ള എല്ലാ ആണുകളും ഈ മിഡിൽ സ്ത്രീജിയന്റെ ഈ ഒരു പ്രോഗ്രാം വനിതകൾ നടത്തുന്ന ഈ പ്രോഗ്രാമിന് വേണ്ടിയിട്ടുള്ള അരയും തലയും മുറുക്കി രംഗത്തിറക്കി അവരെ സപ്പോർട്ട് ചെയ്തുകൊണ്ടിരിക്കുകയാണ് ആ ഒരു വലിയ മെസ്സേജ് ആണ് ഇന്ന് ഈ വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ സ്ത്രീജിയന് മറ്റുള്ളവർക്ക് കൊടുക്കാനുള്ളത് തീർച്ചയായിട്ടും ഈ ഒരു ചരിത്രത്തിലാദ്യമായിട്ടാണെന്ന് 
അദ്ദേഹത്തെ അഭിനന്ദിക്കാനായിട്ട് അദ്ദേഹത്തെ ഏൽപ്പിക്കുന്ന ഒരു പ്രോഗ്രാം വളരെ മനോഹരമായിട്ട് അദ്ദേഹം അത് അണിയിച്ചു ഒരുക്കും നടത്തും അതിവിടെ വീണ്ടും തെളിയിക്കപ്പെട്ടിരിക്കുകയാണ് ഒരിക്കൽ കൂടി മത്തായിയും ബാക്കി അതിന് പിന്നെ പ്രവർത്തിച്ച് എല്ലാവരെയും അഭിനന്ദിക്കാൻ ഞാൻ ഈ അവസരം വിനിയോഗിക്കുന്നു താങ്ക് യു നന്ദി ഒരുപാട് നന്ദി ശ്രീ ടി വി എൻ കുട്ടി ഗ്ലോബൽ സെക്രട്ടറി ശ്രീ ടി വി എൻ കുട്ടിയെ വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു ഫോർ ദ ഫെലിസിറ്റേഷൻ ആദ്യമായി ഇവിടെ ഇരിക്കുന്ന എല്ലാവർക്കും യു എ യുടെ അൻപത്തി ഒന്നാം നാഷണൽ ഡേ ഗ്രീറ്റിംഗ്സ് അറിയിക്കുന്നു ഈ പ്രോഗ്രാമിൻ്റെ Secretary Mrs. Rani Lajish, Treasurer Mrs. Smitha Jain, Namade Elam, WMC Elam Elam Ayar, President Chairman Doni Kurula, Treasurer American Nazi Kurula, Namade Sundam James Kudel, Namade Elam Arathana Aya Vishishta Adithi, Patma Vibhushan Adul Govarshanji, മറ്റ് ഡബ്ല്യു എം സിയുടെ ഗ്ലോബൽ റീജിയൻ പ്രൊവിൻസ് ലീഡേഴ്സ് തീർച്ചയായും ഡബ്ല്യു എം സിയെ സംബന്ധിച്ച് ഇതൊരു അഭിമാന നിമിഷമാണ് ഇത്രയും നല്ലൊരു പരിപാടി നമ്മുടെ സി യു മത്തായിയുടെ ചെയർമാൻഷിപ്പിൽ ഇത് ഇവിടെ ഇറങ്ങാറുകയാണ് നിങ്ങളെല്ലാം നേരത്തെ മിസ്റ്റർ ജെയിംസ് കൂടെ പറഞ്ഞു എല്ലാവരും പ്രതീക്ഷയോടെ കാത്തിരിക്കുന്നത് അടുത്ത് വരുന്ന പരിപാടികൾ കാണാനാണ് തീർച്ചയായും സംഘാടകരെ ഓരോരുത്തരും പേര് പറയാതെ എല്ലാവരെയും ആശംസിച്ചുകൊണ്ട് സദസ്സിരിക്കുന്ന എല്ലാ വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ കുടുംബാംഗങ്ങളെ ഇന്ന് യു എ സംബന്ധിച്ചോളം തീർച്ചയായിട്ടും ഞാൻ ഇവിടെ വന്നിട്ട് ഏകദേശം നാൽപ്പത് വർഷത്തോളമായി ഇത് ആദ്യമായിട്ട് ഞാൻ ഈ യു എ ഭരണാധികാരികൾക്ക് ഞാൻ എൻ്റെ നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുകയാണ് നമുക്ക് എല്ലാവർക്കും ഇന്ന് ഇവിടെ ഈ മീഡിയ കൂടുന്നതിന് തന്നെ നമുക്ക് ഇത് ഇവിടെ അനുവാദം തന്നിട്ടുള്ള ഇവിടെ നമ്മുടെ എല്ലാ പരിപാടികൾക്കും നമ്മുടെ യു എ ഗവൺമെൻറ് വളരെയേറെ നമ്മളെ പ്രോത്സാഹിപ്പിക്കുന്നത് തീർച്ചയായിട്ടും ആ ഭരണാധികാരികൾക്ക് നന്ദി അറിയിച്ചു കൊടുക്കട്ടെ ഇവിടെ യു എ എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാൽ തീർച്ചയായിട്ടും ലോകത്തിൽ ഏറ്റവും കൂടുതൽ അതായത് ഈ അമ്പത്തൊന്ന് വർഷം കൊണ്ട് മറ്റ് ഒരു രാജ്യത്തിനും നേടാൻ സാധിക്കാത്തതിനുള്ള പുരോഗതിയാണ് ഉണ്ടായിരിക്കുന്നത് ഇവിടെ വേൾഡ് ഗിന്നസ് വേൾഡ് റെക്കോർഡ് തന്നെ ഏറ്റവും കൂടുതലുള്ള ലോകത്തെ രാഷ്ട്രം തന്നെ യു എ ആണ് അതിൻ്റെ ഭാഗമായിട്ട് ഞങ്ങളും ആയിട്ടുണ്ട് ഇവിടെ പല ആൾക്കാർക്കും ആ വേൾഡ് ഗിന്നസിൽ പങ്കെടുക്കുവാൻ സാധിച്ചിട്ടുണ്ട് തീർച്ചയായിട്ടും ഞാൻ ഏറ്റവും കൂടുതൽ സന്തോഷിക്കുന്നത് വെച്ചാൽ ഞങ്ങളുടെ വിമൻസ് മാർത്തിന് തീർച്ചയായിട്ടും ഇങ്ങനെ ഒരു നല്ല ഒരു പരിപാടി ഇന്ന് ഇവിടെ സംഘടിപ്പിക്കാൻ സാധിച്ചത് വളരെ സന്തോഷമുണ്ട് ഞങ്ങൾ എപ്പോഴും ഞങ്ങളുടെ വിമൻസ് വാർത്തിന് എപ്പോഴും മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റിൻ്റെ ഞങ്ങൾ എപ്പോഴും പ്രോത്സാഹനം നൽകുന്നുണ്ട് തീർച്ചയായിട്ടും ഇനി അടുത്ത ഇപ്പോഴത്തെ വളരെ നമുക്ക് കണ്ണിന് കാതിന് എല്ലാം പുലർന്നുകയായിട്ടുള്ള ഒരു സാരീക്ഷ നമ്മൾ കണ്ടു ഇന്ത്യയുടെ വിവിധ സംസ്കാരം വിളിച്ചുകൊടുക്കുന്ന ഒരു സാരീശ്വരമാകുന്നത് ഇനി അതുപോലെ തന്നെ ബി ടി യു പേജിൻ്റെ രണ്ടാമത്തെ ഇതിന് വേണ്ടി കാത്തിരിക്കുകയാണ് ആ സമയത്ത് ഒരു നീണ്ട പ്രശ്നത്തിന് ഞാൻ പോകത്തില്ല ഇതിൽ പങ്കെടുക്കുന്ന എല്ലാവർക്കും ആശംസകൾ നേർന്നുകൊണ്ട് ഞാൻ എൻ്റെ വാക്കുകൾ തീർത്തുന്നു താങ്ക് യു വെരി മച്ച് ശ്രീ ഷാറുഹാമി ഗ്ലോബൽ എത്തിക്സ് കമ്മിറ്റി മെമ്പർ ശ്രീമതി ശാന്ത പോളിനെ വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു രണ്ട് വാക്ക് സംസാരിക്കുന്നതിനും ആശംസ അറിയിക്കുന്നതിനുമായി എല്ലാവർക്കും എൻ്റെ വിനീതമായ നമസ്കാരം ബഹുമാനപ്പെട്ട അടൂർ ഗോപാലകൃഷ്ണൻ സർ എൻ്റെ കുടുംബാംഗങ്ങളെ നിങ്ങൾക്ക് നിങ്ങൾക്കെല്ലാവർക്കും എൻ്റെ നമസ്കാരം ഇവിടെ ഇത്ര മനോഹരമായി ഒരുക്കിയിരിക്കുന്ന ഈ പരിപാടിയിൽ പിന്നിൽ പ്രവർത്തിച്ച ശ്രീമതി എസ്തേർ ഐസക്കിനെയും റാണി ലിജേഷിനെയും അഭിനന്ദിക്കാതെ വയ്യ അത്രയേറെ അവർ ആത്മാർത്ഥമായി പ്രവർത്തിച്ചതിൻ്റെ ഫലമാണ് നമ്മൾ ഇന്നിവിടെ കണ്ടുകൊണ്ടിരിക്കുന്നത് ഇവിടെ എല്ലാവരും പറഞ്ഞു ഏത് പുരുഷൻ്റെയും പിന്നിൽ ഒരു വിജയത്തിന് പിന്നിൽ ഒരു സ്ത്രീയുണ്ടെന്ന് ഞാനിപ്പോൾ പറയുന്നത് ശ്രീമതി എസ്തേർ ഐസക്കിൻ്റെ ഈ വിജയത്തിൻ്റെ പിന്നിൽ 
മിസ്റ്റർ ഐസക്കിന്റെ പൂർണ്ണ പിന്തുണ ഉണ്ടായിരുന്നു എന്നുള്ളതാണ് അതിനെയും ഇത്തരണത്തിൽ ഞാൻ അതിന് അതിനും ഞാൻ ഈ തരണത്തിൽ അഭിനന്ദനം അർപ്പിക്കുന്നു എൻ്റെ എല്ലാ ഈ പരിപാടിയുടെ എല്ലാവിധ വിജയത്തിനും എൻ്റെ ആശംസകൾ നേർന്നുകൊണ്ട് ഞാൻ നന്ദി നമസ്കാരം ഒരുപാട് നന്ദി താങ്ക് യു സോ മച്ച് മിസ്സസ് ചാന്താപ്പോൾ അടുത്തതായി നമ്മൾ ഏതൊരു കാത്തിരുന്ന ആ ഒരു മൊമെൻറ്റിലേക്ക് ആ ഒരു വ്യക്തിയിലേക്ക് കിടക്കുകയാണ് ഞാൻ മുൻപേ പറഞ്ഞതുപോലെ തന്നെ ഒരുപാട് 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 ഓർത്ത് വയ്ക്കാൻ എന്തും മനസ്സോട് ചേർത്ത് വയ്ക്കാൻ ഒരുപാട് ലിഫ്റ്റുകൾ സമ്മാനിച്ച നിരവധി ചലച്ചിത്രങ്ങൾ ഇപ്പോഴും റെഫറൻസ് ആയിട്ട് യൂസ് ചെയ്യുന്ന ഒരുപാട് ചലച്ചിത്രങ്ങൾ നമുക്ക് സമ്മാനിച്ച മലയാള സിനിമയിൽ ലോകോത്തര നിലവാരത്തിലേക്ക് ഉയർത്തിയ ലോണനി ലജൻഡ് ശ്രീ അടൂർ ഗോപാലകൃഷ്ണൻ സർ അദ്ദേഹത്തെ ആദരപൂർവ്വം വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു കൗൺസിലിന്റെ സ്നേഹവും മാതൃവും എല്ലാം ആ കൈയടിയിൽ ഉണ്ടാവണം ഒരു നിറഞ്ഞ കൈയടി അദ്ദേഹത്തിന് അദ്ദേഹത്തിന് ഫ്ലോറുകൾക്കും ചെയ്യുന്നതിനായി ശ്രീമതി എസ് ഐസക്കിനെ വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു ഉത്സാഹമാണ് അവർക്ക് മറ്റ് മുതിർന്നവരെ കണക്ക് വളരെ ഉത്സാഹമാണ് കുട്ടികൾക്ക് അവരെ 
സ്വയം കളികൾ കണ്ടുപിടിക്കുകയും അത് ഇവിടെ കളിച്ചു കൊണ്ടിരിക്കുകയാണ് ചുറ്റി ഓടി അവർ കളിച്ച് കളിക്കുന്ന കാണുമ്പോൾ ഒരു അപ്പൂപ്പനായ എനിക്ക് വളരെ സന്തോഷമാണ് ഈ അപ്പൂപ്പന്മാർക്കാണ് തോന്നുന്നത് കൂടുതലാണ് കുട്ടികളോട് സ്നേഹം തോന്നുന്നത് കാരണം ഈ ചെറുപ്പക്കാർ കുട്ടികളുടെ അവർ കുട്ടികൾ എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞ അവരുടെ ആ പ്രായത്തിൽ ചെറുപ്പത്തിൻ്റെ മറ്റ് ആവശ്യങ്ങളും മറ്റ് ചുമതലകളുമായിട്ട് പോകും പക്ഷെ ഒരു പ്രായം കഴിയുമ്പോഴാണ് നമ്മൾ കുഞ്ഞുങ്ങളെ ശ്രദ്ധിക്കാൻ തുടങ്ങുന്നത് നാട്ടിലെ ഒരു പക്ഷേ നാട്ടിലവർക്ക് കിട്ടാത്ത ഒരു പരിചരണം അവരുടെ അപ്പൂപ്പന്മാരുടെയും അമ്മമാരുടെയും സ്നേഹവും സാഹചര്യ സഹകരണവുമാണ് തീർച്ചയായിട്ടും അതിന് പകരമാണ് ഇതുവരെ എല്ലാവരും ചെയ്യുന്ന കുട്ടികളെയും കൊണ്ടുവന്ന് പങ്കെടുക്കുന്ന സമ്മേളനങ്ങൾ അവിടെ കലാപരിപാടികൾ കാണാൻ പാട്ട് പാടണം ഇത്ര മനോഹരമായിട്ടുണ്ട് രണ്ട് ഒരു ഒരു പാട്ടുകൾ പാട്ട് കേട്ടു ഇങ്ങനെ കലയിലും സംസ്കാരത്തിലും ഒക്കെ താല്പര്യമുള്ള മലയാളികൾ പോയാലും അയാളുടെ കൂടെ വായനയും എഴുത്തും കലയും സംസ്കാരവും ഒക്കെ സഞ്ചരിക്കും അതൊന്നും പുറം നാടുകളിൽ വിട്ടിട്ടല്ല മലയാളി ജീവിക്കുന്നത് അയാൾക്ക് ഭാവിയിലേക്ക് കൊടുക്കാം ഭാവിയിലേക്ക് തുടർന്നുള്ള ജീവിതത്തിലേക്കുള്ള സമ്പാദ്യങ്ങളാണ് ഈ ആസ്വാദന ക്ഷമത എന്ന് പറയുന്നത് തീർച്ചയായിട്ടും ഈ വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിലിൻ്റെ വനിതാ വിഭാഗത്തിൻ്റെ ഈ ആഘോഷങ്ങൾക്ക് എല്ലാവിധ ആശംസകളും നേരിടും നമസ്കാരം ഒരു ചടങ്ങിലേക്ക് കടക്കാണ് അതിന് മുൻപായിട്ട് നമ്മുടെ എല്ലാവരും ദയവായിട്ട് ഒന്ന് വേദിയിലേക്ക് സദസ്സിലേക്ക് കടന്നിരിക്കേണ്ടതാണ് പുറത്തു നിൽക്കുന്ന എല്ലാവരോടും അകത്തേക്ക് കയറിയിരിക്കാൻ റിക്വസ്റ്റ് ചെയ്യുന്നു അടുത്തതായി നമ്മുടെ വിമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെ പ്രൊവിൻസ് വിവിധ പ്രൊവിൻസിലുള്ള ഒഫീഷ്യൽസിനെ അവാർഡ് നൽകുന്ന ഒരു ചടങ്ങിലേക്കാണ് കടക്കുന്നത് അതിന് മുൻപായിട്ട് ഐ റിക്വസ്റ്റ് മിസ്സസ് എസ്തറൈസിൻ മിസ്സസ് റാണി ലി ജയേഷ് മിസ്സസ് സ്മിത ജയൻ മിസ്സസ് ജാനറ്റ് വോഗീസ് ആൻഡ് മിസ്സസ് ശാന്ത പോൾ ടു കൈൻഡ്ലി ജോയിൻ ഓൺ ദ സ്റ്റേജ് കഴിഞ്ഞ രണ്ടു വർഷക്കാലമായുള്ള അവരുടെ പ്രവർത്തനത്തിന് നമ്മുടെ ശ്രീ അടൂർ ഗോപാലകൃഷ്ണൻ സർ അദ്ദേഹത്തിന്റെ കയ്യിൽ നിന്നും അവർ അവാർഡ് ഏറ്റു വാങ്ങുന്ന ഒരു ചടങ്ങിലേക്കാണ് കടക്കുന്നത് ഐ ഇൻവൈറ്റ് അജ്മാൻ പ്രൊവിൻസിൽ നിന്നും വിമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിനെ റെപ്രസെന്റ് ചെയ്ത് പ്രസിഡന്റ് മിസ്സസ് നസീല ഹുസൈൻ സെക്രട്ടറി മിസ്സസ് ഇനസ് അനാസ് ആൻഡ് ട്രഷറർ ഓഫ് മിസ്സസ് ബിന്ദു ബാബു മൂന്ന് പേരെ വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു പ്ലീസ് ഒരു നിറഞ്ഞ കയ്യടി അജ്മാൻ പ്രോവിൻസിന്റെ വിമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിൽ നിന്നും പ്രസിഡന്റ് സെക്രട്ടറി ട്രഷറർ നസീല ഹുസൈൻ ഇനാസ് ആൻഡ് ബിന്ദു ബാബു ആണ് ശ്രീ അടൂർ ഗോപാലകൃഷ്ണൻ സാറിന്റെ കയ്യിൽ നിന്നും ആ ഒരു മെമിറ്റോ അവാർഡ് ഏറ്റു വാങ്ങുന്നത് താങ്ക് യു സോ മച്ച് ഇൻവൈറ്റിംഗ് അലൈൻ പ്രൊവിൻസിൽ നിന്നും പ്രസിഡന്റ് സെക്രട്ടറി ചെയർ ലേഡി ആൻഡ് ജോയിന്റ് സെക്രട്ടറി പ്രസിഡന്റ് മിസ്സസ് ആൻസി ജെയിംസ് സെക്രട്ടറി മിസ്സസ് അഞ്ജന രാജീവ് ചെയർ ലേഡി മിസ്സസ് റിറ്റി ജോസ് ആൻഡ് ജോയിന്റ് സെക്രട്ടറി മിസ്സസ് സോണി ലാൽ എന്നിവരെ വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കുന്നു എല്ലാവരുടെയും പേരിൽ ശ്രീമതി സോണിലാൽ ആ ഒരു അവാർഡ് ഏറ്റുവാങ്ങുന്നു ടു ദ എൻറ്റി ഗോപാലൈൻ പ്രോവിൻസ് എ ഹ്യൂജ് റൗണ്ട് ഓഫ് അപ്ലോഡ് ഇൻവൈറ്റിംഗ് ദുബായ് പ്രോവിൻസ് പ്രസിഡന്റ് ശ്രീമതി ആശ ചാൾസ് സെക്രട്ടറി ഡോക്ടർ ജോഷിറ ഷാബു ആൻഡ് ട്രഷറർ മിസ്സസ് ടി സി ജോൺ എ ഹ്യൂജ് റൗണ്ട് ഓഫ് അപ്ലോഡ് to the vibe province Fujera province il ninnu Shrimati Lakshmi Prakash president etti chernittin etti chernittundo yes Lakshmi Prakash is here Lakshmi Fujera province president aanu oru niranja kayidi
Sharjah Province Alumni President Reshmi Vinish, Milana Ajit Secretary, Sheba Biju Treasurer. Any very very late shirley kid no? Good day to all of you guys. Umal Queen Province Alumni no? Chairperson. Shrimati Mosi Matthew, President Shrimati Usha Sunil, and Secretary Shrimati Devi Suma. Umal Queen Province, Chairperson Mrs. Mosi Matthew, President Mrs. Usha Sunil, and Secretary Mrs. Devi Suma. Kaidi, Kaidi Tila, Kaidi Randu Ashwate. Jadi, apa yang perwakilan mana yang terus yang itu, ini satu event itu, kita orang marah marah itu boleh untuk kerana macam dua belas tahun itu, orang orang program semua itu, WMC semua itu, mereka mudahnya kita ni ada. Alkohol province ni ada Archana Abhishek, on behalf of President Archana Abhishek, Secretary Husna Asif, Treasurer Shamla Najib, ini orang ni abah betul, Lakshmi Lal ni beri lagi share kita untuk receive the award. Alkohol province ni ada. Archana Abhishek, Husna Asif, Shamla Najib, and Nivana Abhavatil, on behalf of them, Lakshmi Lal is receiving the award. Beharit Province, on behalf of the President Sandhya Raj, I request Ms. Reshmi Santosh to receive the memento. Oman Province, Again, on behalf of Secretary Rija Jones and Joint Secretary Usha Hasha, I request Ms. Mehja Bin to receive the award. Ms. Mehja Bin. <laughs> Kuwait Province, on behalf of Chairperson Josie Kishore, I request Ms. Mary Mall to receive the memento. Ms. Mary Mall Ignatius. Kuwait Province on behalf of Chairperson Jossi Kishore, Ms. Mary Mall Ignatius is receiving the memento. Kuwait Province on yes, uh, Qatar Province on on behalf of President Kajal Musa, Secretary Simi and Treasurer Charishma, I request Ms. Mera Baby to receive the award. Ms. Mera Baby is receiving the award on behalf of Ms. Kajal Musa. Ms. Simi and Ms. Jarishma. Oru, oru vekte kodi oru vedi memento dalgena thay thendu. Nambadi yadi sari shukra manohara maithi thamu kevade. Avadari pichha choreographer Ms. Bibi Jacob. Bibi a vedi leka snehaburum chagdam cheyido. Inviting Ms. Bibi Jacob. Okay, alat pichha thay thila. और और अवॉर्ड वोड़े इन्दर डब्ल्यूएमसी लॉ का मलयाला भाषा वेदी डे आप ही मुख्य थे ना नवंबर ओन दिन है केरला पर वेदी वाले भाषा जा दिना चरण ना हो अदनो डाल बंद इच्छत नारन कलारों बंगले कुछ कुटियाल कोला आवागाह मंसला का काटें थोड़ी है ना पहले रु मंसरों संगठित पिचे लो अदने मलाम अरे मुझ पर इतना मेरे बीबी इतनी चेयर दे चुन्दर श्रीमती बीबी जे कब ह्यूज राउंड ऑफ अप्लाउस और सारी शोधकर मानव हर माइटर नमक इमरे प्रेसेंट जी इधर दिला फुल क्रेडिट्स बीबी क्या आना थैंक यू सो मच बीबी फॉर द वंडरफुल जॉब यू हैव डॉन Atau lagi yang pada pada logo bahasa Wedi ini, orang itu tinggal lagi kanan kanan. Kita ini Mumbai ter. I request the global chairman, Mr. Johnny Kuruvilla, global VP admin, acting president, DXB province, and general convener, Sri Mr. C U Matai, yang diberi Wedi lagi share dengan tu. Sponsor ini tu jelah dah. First prize ayer diamond ring 
sponsor of our global chairman, Sri Johnny Kuruna sir. Second and third prize cash prizes are sponsored by our global VP admin, Sri C.U. Mathai. And the first prize winner is Ananya Anish, Travali Province. Hello, kind of you. Please welcome to you, Ananya Anish. WMC log of Malayala Bhasha made the Abhi Mukhetil Sangadi picture. Malsaratine, winner Anna, Ananya Anish. She's from Alain Province. And the second prize goes to Adhika Nitin. Adhika, again, she's from Alain Province. Adhika, another kind of notice for them, Shriyam Adhika Nitin. Prozana Samaram. Lady Rikin, Alia Nujum Navas. Prothana Samanam good in the Kunjana Vedication, Alia Nujum Navas. They teach him now. Okay, all right. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, sir, for your time. Thank you, all the dignitaries. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome Rishika Raj on the stage with a huge round of applause. Rishika, song on a set of the Kiana. Even the Chasham, the Shed of Urbana, Albany, Samsarika, and another name Chasham. Random round of the Kodi Baki in the number of judges would a coffee put on the rest of the room. Now we can say, add the round and three minutes. I'll be in the room. Inviting Rishika Raj with a huge round of applause, please. I should have one guy that I can do. If she can give me a baby, let them in there.
Thank you so much, Rishika. Rishika, one of our medal ganam, Rishika, all of which are new. After that, Rithi ke kudi vedile ke shreni ke ana oru ganathri vendi ta. Adhani sheesham, namre sundari kuttu lakka again vandhi chinte second round ne vendi ta ready ready ke ana judges ready ana and the contestants are also ready. Yero ganathri sheesham at three minute na namre second round ne ko pogo na ayirikum. Over to Rithi ka. Konjam nelave, konjam nerappu, one dry sand dal endun deham. Konjam nanch, konjam mamdam, one dry sand dal endun kangal. Konjam meraham, konjam kadavul, one dry sand dal endun nenjum. Chandrale.
கொஞ்சம் நிலவ கொஞ்சம் நெருப்பு ஒன்றாய் சேர்ந்தால் தேகம் கொஞ்சம் நஞ்ச கொஞ்சம் அமுதம் ஒன்றாக சேர்ந்தால் தென் கண்கள் கொஞ்சம் மிருகம் கொஞ்சம் கடவுள் ஒன்றாய் சேர்ந்தால் நெஞ்சம் சந்திரலே கா Thank you so much. We have a performance in the backstage. We have a performance in the backstage. Thank you so much. Ready? We have a great attire in the sidelight. And we are moving on to the second round of the pageant. Welcoming all the contestants for the second round and the stage is all yours. <coughs> Music please. Ready. Wall Malayali, Wall Malayali Queen, Queen ala, Queens, the way they look at the other. Kaidi on Ningle, very low in the part of the Nikian and Thonu Namade. Participants, a lot of Kaidi or the Namade, where in the Oro participants in them are confidence, other than the Navarra energy in the Paranaka Kaidiana. Chalva, Chalva. Yo, blaze up the walk, light it up to the beat. Come on, Chalva. Give it to me, Chalva. Give it to me, Chalva. Gorgeous just with attitude and every latitude. Yes, I'm fully come on, baby, do your dirty work. Just more go ahead, yeah, Chalva. Just more go ahead, yeah, Chalva. Show her the community, yeah, Chalva. What's the community, yeah, Chalva. Tell them like it is. I can't hear it. Jalba, 
Oh my God, that was a fabulous performance. Like erection, I mean, Trem, Trem, Ruthi, I did Trem. Nalla kiddle na it. Kutiyala groomi idhar thay na turche item. Simi, you really deserves, you really deserve a huge round of applause, Simi. <laughs> She really deserves a huge round of applause. Lord, apam thane Sri Silphi. Sherry, you are very professional. I did la oru performance, like oru show ka ananda feel thane idharno. And second round like that. Ningle jari ke endu onna na kutele parangiya thoda because second round like that. Idu thodam eight contestants matra mana pogna thoda. Idu judges ne question answer round facei am pogna thoda eight contestants ana. And jadi ne numbers enda kai lende. Thoda idu first round thodam second round like that poye kutegalde. Chess numbers enda kai lende thoda. Ippe yor rehse enikim judges ne matra harilo. And 
Ready alle ningal? To hear the results, ready ano? Excited? Tensed? Heart beats enikku ivada kekkam. Nalla oru kaiyade ella kuttikalkum. Itrey neram nammude munbilekku vanna oro kuttikalkum nalla oru kaiyade kodukkam. And we are moving on to the results. Second round like aaru kyaanu kadakkunnathu nu ariyam. I'll call upon the chess numbers. അടുത്ത റൗണ്ടിലേക്ക് കടക്കുന്ന ആദ്യത്തെ വ്യക്തി ചെസ് നോമ്പോ വൺ വൃന്ദ കൺഗ്രാച്ചുലേഷൻസ് വൃന്ദ കണ്ടിസ്റ്റ് നോമ്പോ ടു കണ്ടിസ്റ്റ് നോമ്പോ എനി ഗസസ് ഫൈവ് Contestant number 5 and contestant number nalla rest and urum mokam kaanu 6 contestant number 7 ini ee 14 peril ninnu already 5 peru vedilekku etti kaynju adutha round lekku etti kaynju and rendu peru odi aanu baaki ullathu And the second last contestant, contestant number eight. And the last contestant, oh my god, three pairs of LRM heartbeats are going to get up. And the final contestant, contestant number 12. A huge round of applause to all the contestants. ഞാനിവിടെ നിൽക്കും ഓക്കെ ആൻഡ് ഇനി ഈ ഏഴ് പേര് ദേൽ ഹാവ് ടു ഫേസ് ദ ക്വസ്റ്റ്യൻസ് ബൈ ദ ജഡ്ജസ് അപ്പോൾ ജഡ്ജസിന് ഇതിൽ ജഡ്ജസിൻ്റെ പേരാണ് ഉണ്ടാവുക ടു ഓൾ ദ കൻഡസ്റ്റൻസ് ഇതിൽ ജഡ്ജസിൻ്റെ പേരാണ് ഉണ്ടാവുക യു വിൽ ഹാവ് ടു ചൂസ് എനി വൺ സോ ആ ജഡ്ജ് ആയിരിക്കും നിങ്ങളോട് ചോദ്യം ചോദിക്കുന്നുണ്ടാവുക ക്ലിയോ ഓക്കെ ഓക്കെ അവിടെ തുടങ്ങാം ടേക്ക് എനി വൺ ജഡ്ജസ് പ്ലീസ് നോട്ട് കണ്ടിസ്റ്റ് നമ്പർ ടു മിസ്റ്റർ വിവേക് മേനൻ ഹായ് ഐശ്വര്യ ഹായ് സർ സോ യുവർ ക്വസ്റ്റ്യൻ ഫോർ ടുഡേ what as per you is the best way to bounce back from disappointment thank you for the question sir i believe the best way to bounce back from disappointment is to learn from where you went wrong i am a person who considers every mistake and every single failure as a stepping stone towards success only when you learn from your mistakes and only with that experience will you be able to grow as a person and eventually become a better version of yourself so i don't see another way apart from learning from your mistakes to overcome disappointment thank you thank you namrata prakash ma Good evening ma'am. Yeah, hi, good evening. How are you doing today? Good. Better. <laughs> yeah. Great. So your question would be uh what will be your one advice which you would like to give to young women dealing with pressure nowadays? Okay. Um the one advice that I would give to women with dealing with pressure I say is that um try to prioritize things equally. Um try not to take stress as much as women do. So when you feel pressured just do things that you love first so you get an ease to do what you want to do next so that's my answer thank you thank you thank you shri tulasi ma'am Hi 
Hi, uh, Julia. Yes, ma'am. Hi, how are you doing? I'm doing great, thank you. Julia, I remember uh, getting the idea that you were a multitasker of sorts. Yes. Your mother too, I remember? Yes, yes mother yes. of two girls. I, uh, I have a question. If you had an extra 30 minutes in a day, so that's 24 hours and 30 minutes, what would you do with those 30 minutes? I would definitely use the 30 minutes to spend with my kids because any extra time that I get, I would use it to spend with my kids because as they grow, I would miss the childhood that they have now. So I don't, I don't really want to miss any part of their beautiful childhood because with every day they would grow and I wouldn't want to miss any of that. And also, the, if you ask my kids, the thing that they would miss the most during the day would be their mom. So any extra minute that I would get would be the happiest moment for them. So I would try to spend that with my kids. Thank, Thank you. you. Beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. Dr. Smida Prabhagar. Good evening. Yeah, I'm good. Hello. Yeah. Good evening, Anisha. How good are you doing today? I am very happy. <laughs> Fantastic. Anisha, human brain seems to have been processing 70,000 you know, thoughts per day, right? We've got many, many thoughts. So if you win the crown today, what are the first three thoughts which would pass your mind in the first minute? Uh, can you tell Malayalam also? Yes. So human brain, 70,000 thoughts on a daily basis. We've got many, many thoughts. So average scientists have discovered 70,000 thoughts. So this crown win, what are the first three thoughts which will cross your mind? in the first three thoughts. Thank you for the question, ma'am. Manishnai Piranda Namak, Eduvadinairam thoughts upon Nana, ma'am, and not of another. Idile, Yan or a crown winchay the Tendingil, Adaliniki moon and the Munil Pona, Yan Enil wishes children down in Yanivad another, Aduandana in a crown cut the other, Adana in Kathi might to thought to Yampona, Pine, Yan and Norivetti, Nali Makalim Noki, Havidam Noki, Jolie Elanka in one Nikanadana, after a train positive I take it with a Nikam Pachungi, Ori good team, Dandu good team, Moon the good team, Mulla Ningal Kalavakum, Endu Gundan in the Guda, Endu Lori Totum, Enikitaram Pachum Ningaka, Munamat or Totu on the Tendangil, Elam, Life will end the Kavanalum, positive I tango to Munera, Itra Loniki. Thank you so much. Uh, Namrata Prakash. Hi, how are you doing? I'm doing great. What about you, ma'am? I'm good. Thank you so much. You're looking beautiful, by the way. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> so, my question would be, um, who is your role model? And one thing which you have learned from them and you actually do incorporate in your personal life? Thank you for the question, ma'am. I always believe and I'll still say that my mom has been my role model since the day she had supported me, which is eventually why, because uh, since the time I see her, she's a multitasker and she's always helped me in whichever uh, aspects of my life when it comes to education as well as extracurricular activities, let it be anything. She's always been my support and also she takes care of my family as well. So I will always say it's my mom. And one thing I've always learned from her is how to cope up with everything together and deal any problem in life in a very optimistic manner. And I think that is one of the most astonishing things any human can do Think of any problem in a positive way because all of the problems have a solution and that's what keeps me strong. Thank you. Shri Tulsi. Hi. Uh, 
Hi, Prayaga. Yes, hi. How are you? I'm good. How are I you? I love the glitter. Thank you. Very pretty. Prayaga, I have a question for you. Um, let me see. What do you like the most about yourself? And what, why is this? Yes. Uh, so the question is what I like the most about myself. I love my smile. I keep smiling all the time. Smile is my confidence. Smiling makes me happy and it makes other people also happy. So my biggest strength and feature, if you ask me, is my smile. Thank you. Thank you. Dr. Smita Prabhakar. Good evening, Brinda. How are you doing today? Good evening. I'm doing fine. Thank you. Fantastic. Great. Brinda, could you tell me, where do you see yourself in the next five years? I see, me, I see myself as a successful architect and a designer. And I want to see my mother being happy. I want to provide her everything that she requires. And that is what I want to do, be successful, make a lot of money and give her all the happiness. Thank you. Thank you so much, all the participants. A huge round of applause to all the wonderful women over here. All right, Yanar Cheria, break it again because we are moving on to the gala event. Third round of good in a so, that's why we are going to get the gala event in the third round. And all the participants will be there. Here to chat, I'm going to official reward of thanks in a way. I invite Ms. Smita Jain, our treasurer. Inviting Ms. Smita Jain, treasurer, to deliver the vote of thanks. As I mentioned, Gala even starts here. Adri Munbaita, word of thanks, Parinadanai, Srimati Bindu, Shemikanam, Smita Jain, Smita Jain, Shemikinu, I'm a treasurer, Anna. Priyapata World Malayali Council, Global, Region, Provincial Baravahigal, Kudumbangangal, Mati Vishishta Viktitungal, Ella Varkum, and the Vinida Maya Namaskaram. UAE National Day Aya in the Ingene or Paribadi Sangadi Piku and Karinadil, Namukere Abimanikam. Etu Madi Mai Nandi Parayande, Itrium Brahataya or Paribadi Sangadi Piku, Kure Divasamai Ahura from Prayak Nicha. World Malayali Council Global Advisory Board Chairman Sri Isaac Sarniyane. 
നിറഞ്ഞ സദസ്സിനെ സാക്ഷി നിർത്തി ശ്രീ ഐസക് ജോൺ പട്ടാണിപ്പറമ്പിലിനെ ഐസക് സാറിനെ വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെ പേരിലും റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെ പേരിലും നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു നമ്മുടെ ക്ഷണം സ്വീകരിച്ച് ഇന്നിവിടെ എത്തിയ മുഖ്യ അതിഥി ശ്രീ അടൂർ ഗോപാലകൃഷ്ണൻ സാറിനും വിശിഷ്ടാതിഥി ജോൺ സാമുവലിനും വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെയും റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെയും പേരിൽ നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു ഇന്നത്തെ പരിപാടിയുടെ സ്പോൺസർമാരായ ടുല കിയോസ്കിയ മലബാർ ഡയമണ്ട് ലുലു എക്സ്ചേഞ്ച് ലുലു ഫാഷൻ കൊണ്ടൂർ ഇൻഡിഗോ തോംസൺ എക്സ്പാറ്റോ സഫീർ മാൾ ഫ്ലോറ ക്രീക് ഹോട്ടൽ എന്നീ സ്ഥാപനങ്ങൾക്കും വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെയും റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിൻ്റെയും പേരിൽ നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു ഈ പരിപാടിയിൽ പങ്കെടുത്ത് നമുക്കെല്ലാം ഊർജം പകർന്ന ഗ്ലോബൽ ചെയർമാൻ ശ്രീ ജോണി കുരുവിള ഗ്ലോബൽ ട്രഷറർ ശ്രീ ജെയിംസ് കൂടൽ ഗ്ലോബൽ വി പി മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയൻ ശ്രീ ചാൾസ് പോൾ ഗ്ലോബൽ അഡ്വൈസറി ബോർഡ് അംഗം അലൈൻ പ്രോവിൻസ് പ്രസിഡന്റുമായ ശ്രീ വർഗീസ് പനക്കൽ ഗ്ലോബൽ സെക്രട്ടറി ടി ടി വി എൻ കുട്ടി അഡ്വൈസറി ബോർഡ് അംഗം ശ്രീ പോൾ വടശ്ശേരി ഗ്ലോബൽ വുമൻസ് ഫോറം ശ്രീമതി ജാനറ്റ് വർഗീസ് എത്തിക്സ് കമ്മിറ്റി അംഗം ശ്രീമതി ശാന്ത പോൾ എന്നിവർക്കും വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെ പേരിലും റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെ പേരിലും നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു ശ്രീ സി യു മത്തായി അദ്ദേഹം ഗ്ലോബൽ വി പി അഡ്മിൻ ദുബായ് പ്രൊവിൻസ് ആക്ടിംഗ് പ്രസിഡന്റ് പ്രോഗ്രാം കൺവീനർ ഇത്രയും പകിട്ടാർന്ന ഒരു പരിപാടിക്ക് നേതൃത്വം നൽകിയ ശ്രീ സി യു മത്തായിക്ക് വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെയും റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെയും പേരിൽ നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു ഇന്നത്തെ ഈ പരിപാടിക്ക് നേതൃത്വം കൊടുത്ത മുൻ നിരയിൽ നിന്നും നയിച്ച വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറം പ്രസിഡന്റ് നമ്മുടെയെല്ലാം പ്രിയപ്പെട്ട ശ്രീമതി എസ്തർ ഐസക്കിനും പരിപൂർണ്ണ പിന്തുണയുമായി ഒപ്പം പ്രവർത്തിച്ച റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറം ട്രഷറർ സെക്രട്ടറി റാണി ലിജേഷിനും വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെയും റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെയും പേരിൽ നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു ഈ പരിപാടിയുടെ വിജയത്തിനായി അകമഴിഞ്ഞ സഹകരണം നൽകിയ റീജിയൻ പ്രസിഡന്റ് ശ്രീ ഷാഹുൽ ഹമീദ് ചെയർമാൻ ശ്രീ ടി കെ വിജയൻ സെക്രട്ടറി ജനറൽ ശ്രീ സന്തോഷ് കെട്ടെ ട്രഷറർ ശ്രീ രാജീവ് കുമാർ വി പി അഡ്മിൻ ശ്രീ വിനീഷ് മോഹൻ വി പി ഓർഗനൈസേഷൻ ഡെവലപ്മെന്റ് ശ്രീ ജെ എൻ വടക്കേ വീട്ടിൽ സെക്രട്ടറി സി എ ബിജു മീഡിയ ഫോറം ചെയർമാൻ വി എസ് ബിജുകുമാർ എന്നിവർക്കും വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെയും റീജിയന്റെയും വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെയും പേരിൽ നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു പരിപാടിയുടെ വിജയത്തിനായി പ്രവർത്തിച്ച വിവിധ തരം കമ്മിറ്റികളുണ്ട് കമ്മിറ്റികൾ 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 ഫുഡ് കമ്മിറ്റി ഇൻവിറ്റേഷൻ കമ്മിറ്റി കൾച്ചറൽ കമ്മിറ്റി ബ്യൂട്ടി പേജൻറ്റ് കമ്മിറ്റി സാരി ഷോ കമ്മിറ്റി വളണ്ടിയർ കമ്മിറ്റി ഗസ്റ്റ് റിലേഷൻ കമ്മിറ്റി കോംപ്ലൈൻറ്റ് കമ്മിറ്റി സ്റ്റേജ് കമ്മിറ്റി അഡ്വൈസറി കമ്മിറ്റി പബ്ലിസിറ്റി കമ്മിറ്റി എന്നിവയ്ക്ക് നേതൃത്വം കൊടുത്ത കൺവീനർമാർക്കും ഇതിൽ പ്രവർത്തിച്ച എല്ലാവർക്കും വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെയും വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെയും പേരിൽ നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു ബ്യൂട്ടി പേജന്റ് സാരി ഷോ എന്നീ പരിപാടികളിൽ പങ്കെടുത്ത എല്ലാവർക്കും മേക്കപ്പ് ആർട്ടിസ്റ്റുകൾ ഹെയർ സ്റ്റൈലിസ്റ്റ് ചെയ്ത ആർട്ടിസ്റ്റുകൾ സാരി ഷോ കോറിയോഗ്രാഫർ ബി ബി ജേക്കബ് ബ്യൂട്ടി പേജന്റ് കോറിയോഗ്രാഫർ സിമി മോൾ റിജോ സുൽഫി അലി എന്നിവർക്കും വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെയും റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെയും പേരിൽ നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു അവതാരകയായ ശ്രീമതി നിഷ യൂസഫിനും പ്രാർത്ഥനാ ഗാനം ആലപിച്ച ബിന്ദു ബാബുവിനും ഗാനം ആലപിച്ച രശ്മി വിനീഷ് പ്രിയ രാജേഷ് ഋതിക രാജ് ഋഷിക രാജ് ഡാൻസ് അവതരിപ്പിച്ച ഷാർജ പ്രൊവിൻസ് ടീമിനും ദുബായ് പ്രൊവിൻസ് ടീമിനും കീബോർഡ് വായിച്ച നിഷാൽ നസീറിനും വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെയും റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെയും പേരിൽ നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു നമ്മുടെ ഇന്നത്തെ പ്രോഗ്രാമിന്റെ ജഡ്ജസായ ശ്രീ വിവേക് മേനോൻ ഡോക്ടർ ശ്രീമതി സ്മിത പ്രഭാകർ ശ്രീമതി ശ്രീ തുളസി ശ്രീമതി നമ്രത പ്രകാശ് എന്നിവർക്കും വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ്റ്റ് റീജിയന്റെയും റീജിയൻ വുമൻസ് ഫോറത്തിന്റെയും പേരിൽ നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു ഇന്നത്തെ നമ്മുടെ പരിപാടിക്ക് വീഡിയോഗ്രാഫേഴ്സും ആയിട്ടും ഫോട്ടോഗ്രാഫേഴ്സായിട്ടും പ്രവർത്തിച്ച എല്ലാവർക്കും വേൾഡ് മലയാളി കൗൺസിൽ മിഡിൽ ഈസ
വുമൺസ് ഫോറത്തിൻ്റെ പേരിലും നന്ദി അറിയിക്കുന്നു ഇതിൽ ആരെയും വിട്ടുപോയിട്ടുണ്ടെങ്കിൽ വിനീതമായി ക്ഷമിക്കുക നന്ദി നമസ്കാരം താങ്ക് യു വെരി മച്ച് ശ്രീമതി സ്മിത ജയൻ as i mentioned before we are moving on to the gala event world malayali council middle east region women's forum inde yoru beauty pageant thudarunnadayirikkum adinde grand finale nammude gala event inde idayil thanne nadakkunnadayirikkum oh to the gala event Rajamundri, Chennai Pur Male, Kola Pur Port Blair India or abroad We have this connectivity thing figured That worked up an appetite Chicken Jungli Sandwich More Cookie Tins Small Efficient Aircraft And new Shiny Aircraft And even more Aircraft India's largest fleet Reporting for duty
زينب الله دار الهوى سامي يا ابو عبد الله سيارنا سافر وتوكل بالله دار الهوى سامي يا ابو عبد الله سيارنا سافر وتوكل بالله دار الهوى سامي يا ابو عبد الله سيارنا سافر وتوكل Previously Toshiba Memory announced 3D Flash Memory technology.
ഗാല ഇവൻസിന് മുൻപായിട്ട് നമ്മളൊരു ചെറിയ സെഷനിലേക്ക് കൂടി കിടക്കുകയാണ് എത്ര പേര് ഇവിടെ ഫുട്ബോൾ കാണുന്നവരുണ്ട് കൈപൊക്കിക്കേ ആ ഓക്കെ ഒരു ഫുട്ബോൾ ക്യൂസ് ഒരു ഫുട്ബോൾ മെമ്മറീസ് എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞിട്ട് ഒരു പ്രോഗ്രാമിലേക്കാണ് കിടക്കുന്നത് വളരെ ചെറിയൊരു ഇവൻറ്റാണ് തോഷുബയാണ് നിങ്ങൾക്ക് വേണ്ടിയിട്ട് ഈ ഒരു ഇവൻറ്റ് കോർഡിനേറ്റ് ചെയ്ത് ഓർഗനൈസ് ചെയ്തിട്ടുള്ളത് അതിലേക്ക് നമ്മുടെ വേദിയിലേക്ക് ആ ഒരു ഇവൻറ്റ് കണ്ടക്ട് ചെയ്യാൻ വേണ്ടിയിട്ട് ലെറ്റ് മീ വെൽക്കം ക്ലബ് ഓഫ് ആർ ജെ ആർ ജെ താൻവീർ ഒരു നിറഞ്ഞ കൈയ്യോട് കൂടി സ്വാഗതം ചെയ്യാം ആർ ജെ താൻവീർ ഓൺ ടു ദ സ്റ്റേജ് കൈഡി കൈഡി നല്ലൊരു കൈഡി താങ്ക് യു ആൾ Thank you so much. Good evening everyone. How many football fans here? How many Brazil fans? Brazil fans make some noise. Okay, I'm an Argentina fan. How many Argentina fans? Woo! Superb. I'm Arjay Tanvir from Club FM 99.6. കുറച്ച് പേര് എന്നെ കേട്ടിട്ടുണ്ടാവും കലക്കൻ റീചാർജ് എന്ന് പറയുന്ന ഷോ രാവിലെ ഏഴ് മണി മുതൽ പതിനൊന്ന് മണി വരെ ഞാൻ ചെയ്യുന്നുണ്ട് വിത്ത് ആർ ജെ ശ്രുതി എന്തായാലും ഇന്ന് തോഷുബയെ റെപ്രസെൻറ്റ് ചെയ്താണ് ഞാനിവിടെ നിൽക്കുന്നത് ഒരുപാട് സന്തോഷമുണ്ട് റേഡിയോയിൽ കേട്ടിട്ടുണ്ടാവും നിങ്ങൾ തോഷുബ വേൾഡ് കപ്പ് മെമ്മറീസ് എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞൊരു കോണ്ടസ്റ്റ് നടക്കുന്നുണ്ട് ഐ മീൻ കോണ്ടസ്റ്റ് അല്ല ഒരു ട്രിവ്യ പോലെ കുറച്ച് ഓഡിയോസ് അവിടെ പ്ലേ ചെയ്യുന്നുണ്ട് നമ്മൾ അറിയാത്ത നമ്മൾ അറിഞ്ഞിരിക്കേണ്ട കുറേ ഫുട്ബോൾ ഫാക്സും തോഷുബ ഫാക്സും കണക്ട് ചെയ്തിട്ടാണ് അപ്പോൾ ഇന്നിപ്പോൾ ഞാൻ ഇവിടെ ഒരു ഫൺ ക്യൂസ് നടത്താൻ പോവാണ് സമ്മാനമായിട്ട് കിട്ടാൻ പോകുന്നത് ഖത്തർ വേൾഡ് കപ്പിൽ അവർ ഏത് ഫുട്ബോൾ വെച്ചാണോ കളിക്കുന്നത് അതേ ബോളാണ് തോഷിബ നമുക്ക് സമ്മാനമായിട്ട് തരാൻ പോകുന്നത് ആ ബോൾ വേണ്ടേ മാച്ച് ബോളാണ് അഡിഡാസിന്റെ ഐ തിങ്ക് ഓൾമോസ്റ്റ് സിക്സ് ഫിഫ്റ്റി ദ്രംസ് വേർത്ത് ബോളാണ് നെവർ മിസ് ദിസ് അങ്ങനെ സമ്മാനമായിട്ട് കിട്ടുന്നതല്ല അപ്പൊ അത് വിൻ ചെയ്യാനുള്ള ഒരു എക്സ്ക്ലൂസീവ് ചാൻസ് ആണ് ഇപ്പോൾ ഇവിടെയുള്ള ആളുകൾ കിട്ടുന്നത് ഞാൻ എന്തായാലും റാൻഡംലി കുറച്ച് ചോദ്യങ്ങൾ ചോദിക്കാം അതിൽ നിന്ന് ആൻസർ പറയുന്ന ആളുകൾ സ്റ്റേജിലേക്ക് വരാം അവർക്കാണ് ഇത് വിൻ ചെയ്യാനുള്ള അവസരം ഉള്ളത് റെഡി അല്ലേ റെഡി ആണോ യെസ് അപ്പൊ ഉത്തരം അറിയുന്നവർ ആദ്യം ഒന്ന് കൈ വോക്കണം കേട്ടോ എന്റെ കണ്ണിൽ ആരാണ് ആദ്യം പെടുന്നത് അവരായിരിക്കും ഞാൻ സ്റ്റേജിലേക്ക് വിളിക്കുന്നുണ്ടാവാം വിച്ച് കൺട്രി ഹാസ് വോൺ ദി മോസ്റ്റ് വേൾഡ് കപ്പ് ദാറ്റ് ഗൈ ഗ്രീൻ ഷർട്ട് യെസ് കം 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 ടു ദ സ്റ്റേജ് സൂപ്പർ ബ്രസീൽ ഇസ് റൈറ്റ് ആൻസർ ആദ്യം എൻ്റെ കണ്ണിൽ പെട്ടതാണ് കേട്ടോ ഇതിനെനിക്ക് വേറൊരു ഓപ്ഷനും ഇല്ല ഇത്രയും വലിയ ക്രൗഡിൻ്റെ ഇടയിൽ ക്യൂസ് കളിക്കും ഐ എം സോറി അബൌട്ട് ദാറ്റ് അടുത്ത ചോദ്യം വിച്ച് കൺട്രി ഹാസ് അപ്പിയേർഡ് ഇൻ ത്രീ വേൾഡ് കപ്പ് ഫൈനൽസ് ബട്ട് ഒരിക്കലും അവർ ജയിച്ചിട്ടില്ല കമോൺ മാൻ ഡോൺ സീ ദാറ്റ് വിച്ച് കൺട്രി ഹാസ് അപ്പിയേർഡ് ഇൻ ത്രീ വേൾഡ് കപ്പ് ഫൈനൽസ് ബട്ട് നെവർ വോൺ എനി കോമ്പറ്റീഷൻ ഇംഗ്ലണ്ട് നോ 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 ഉറുക്കെ പറയണ്ട ജർമ്മനി പറയണ്ട ആ ഏരിയയിലാണ് ഫുൾ ഭാഗ്യമുള്ളത് കേട്ടോ ആ ഏരിയയിലാണ് ഫുൾ ഭാഗ്യം കിടക്കുന്നത് അടുത്ത ചോദ്യം വളരെ ഈസി ചോദ്യമാണ് എല്ലാവരും എന്നെ കല്ലെടുത്ത് എറിയും തോന്നുന്നു ഹാൻഡ് ഓഫ് ഗോഡ് എന്നറിയപ്പെടുന്ന ഗോൾ സ്കോർ ചെയ്ത് ആരാണ് You already answered, no? Second one, come, 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 come. Yes, two more, two more. Ronaldo is a CR7, we don't know. But in the Real Madrid, there is a big jersey in the Real Madrid. In which jersey? Other than seven. Ronaldo played? No. Nine. Right answer. Come on! Come to the stage! Yes, Real Madrid is the same as JCL. One question is to show you. The recent question is, which country has won Euro Cup 2020? England? No. That country is not the world cup. Where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you from? Italy, come on! Lady with a speck. Come on, one lady. Come on, superb. Yes, we are set for the game. All of you are on the stage. Five names are on the stage. We will go to the game. Let's go to the stage. Superb, superb. Okay, that's a good one. Five, isn't it? Oh. 
ആറ് ചോദ്യം ചോദിച്ചാൽ ആറ് വീഡിയോ ഉണ്ടോ യാ വി വിൽ പ്ലേ വിൽ പ്ലേ നീ വെക്കാം കം യസേനെ നിങ്ങൾ ഇവിടെ ഒരു കുറച്ച് വീഡിയോസ് നമ്മൾ പ്ലേ ചെയ്യും അതൊന്ന് ശ്രദ്ധിക്കണം ഇതുമായി ബന്ധപ്പെട്ടുള്ള ചോദ്യങ്ങളായിരിക്കും ഞാൻ ചോദിക്കുന്നുണ്ടാവുക അതിലൊരു ഫുട്ബോൾ ഫാക്ട് ഉണ്ടാവും അതോടൊപ്പം തന്നെ ഒരു തോഷിബ ഫാക്ട് ഉണ്ടാവും ഇത് രണ്ടും നോക്കി വെക്കണം വീഡിയോ റെഡി യാ The 22-year-old French forward Lucien Laurent made history by scoring the first ever World Cup goal on the 13th of July 1930. In 2007, Kioxia, previously Toshiba Memory, announced 3D flash memory technology. The 1996 World Cup featured the first World Cup mascot, a cartoon lion in a Union flag football shirt and a 60s mop top mane named World Cup Willie. In 2017, Toshiba launched Canvio Advance external hard disk drive with automated backup software and high transfer speeds. Turkish football legend Hakan Suka scored the World Cup's fastest goal in just 10.8 seconds after the opening whistle in the 2002 bronze medal match against South Korea. In 1967, Toshiba entered the storage industry with the 14-inch hard disk drive. often regarded as the best female player of all time and nicknamed Pele in skirts by Pele himself is the first ever footballer to score at five World Cup editions. In 1984, Toshiba replaced Tokyo Shibora Denki as the company's official name. award Ballon d'Or is given to the best player at each World Cup with the first award given in 1982. In 2020, Toshiba launched Canvio Gaming external hard disk drive. Its compatibility with PlayStation, Xbox, PC lets you grow your gaming library. Yes, perfect. Ab idakke aanu nammade facts idile Toshiba facts und football facts und അതിൽ മിക്സ് ചിലപ്പോൾ ഇതിലുള്ളത് ഉണ്ടാവും ഇതില്ലാത്ത ഉണ്ടാവും ഞാൻ ക്ലൂസ് ചെയ്യുന്നുണ്ടാവും ഞാൻ ചോദിക്കുന്ന സമയത്ത് ആൻസർ അറിയുന്നവർ ഒന്ന് കൈബുക്ക ഓക്കെ അപ്പോഴാണ് ഞാൻ നിങ്ങളുടെ അടുത്തേക്ക് വരുന്നുണ്ടാവുക നിങ്ങളത് റൈറ്റ് ആൻസർ പറഞ്ഞു കഴിഞ്ഞാൽ ഓരോ ചോദ്യത്തിന് ഒരു മാർക്ക് അപ്പോൾ ഇതിൽ ഏറ്റവും കൂടുതൽ പോയിന്റ് ആരാണോ നേടുന്നത് അവർക്കാണ് സമ്മാനം കിട്ടാൻ പോകുന്നത് ഫിഫ മാച്ച് ബോളാണ് സമ്മാനം നമുക്കൊന്ന് പരിചയപ്പെടാം പേര് സജി വർക്കിംഗ് സൊല്യൂഷൻ ആർക്കിടെക്ടർ ആൻഡ് ഐ ടി കമ്പനി സജി അൽഫോൺസ് ചാർട്ടേഡ് അക്കൗണ്ടൻ്റ് സൂപ്പർ അൽഫോൺസ് റേജോ ജെയിംസ് എഞ്ചിനീയറായിട്ട് വർക്ക് ചെയ്യുന്നു റേജോ റേജോ ജെയിംസ് ഷാരൻ മറിയം ഫൈനാൻസ് ഷാരൻ മറിയം ഷാരൻ 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 മറിയം എൻ്റെ സ്കോർ ഉണ്ട് അവിടെ നോട്ട് ചെയ്യാൻ വേണ്ടിയിട്ടാണേ യുവർ നെയിം മെഹജബീൻ മെഹജബീൻ മെഹസുബീർ മെഹസബീൻ സുബോ ഹായ് അരുൺ അരുൺ ജോർജ് അരുൺ ജോർജ് പേരൊക്കെ കിട്ടിയല്ലോ ചോദ്യത്തിലേ കിടക്കട്ടെ റെഡി അല്ലേ ആദ്യത്തെ ചോദ്യം ഇതാണ് തൊഷീബ 
entered storage industry with dash inch hard disk drive yes first saji le 14 14 sure yeah 14 is the right answer come on super one point for saji yes adutha chodi or football chodi aanu which player scored fastest goal <laughs> you know yes this guy right yes hakan sukar turkish turkish guy turkish guy turkish forward hakan sukar one more point your name arun. arun yes one point for arun next question in which year company officially changed its name to toshiba yes Uh, 2017 2017 are you sure yeah no i don't know 1984 1984 is the right answer come on one more point super adutha chodyam who is the first player to score score five goals in world cup Uh, a female she is from uh, brazil martha martha is the right answer come on ee world cup il aanu rendam oru player nammude cristiano ronaldo score cheyidathu avashe or aanne kaalu munbe or lady score cheyidirund ladies happy le superb adutha chodyam enikku almost namukku or winner aayin thonnu adutha or chodyathilekku kudi povam in 2004 toshiba got guinness world record for manufacturing world's smallest dash ഇതിൽ ഈ വീഡിയോ കൂടെ പ്ലേ ചെയ്തിട്ടില്ല അതുകൊണ്ട് ഞാൻ നിങ്ങൾക്ക് ക്ലൂ വരാം ആദ്യം കൈ വയ്ക്കുന്ന ആരാണെന്ന് സഹായിക്കണേ ഞാനിത് വായിച്ചുകൊണ്ടിരിക്കുകയാണേ ക്ലൂ ഇതൊക്കെയാണ് എസ് ഡി കാർഡ് ഓർ എച്ച് ഡി ഡി എച്ച് ഡി ഡി റൈറ്റ് ആൻസർ ഐ തിങ്ക് വി ഹാവ് എ പെർഫെക്റ്റ് ക്ലിയർ വിൻ വി ഹാവ് ആൻഡ് ഇസ് നെയിം ഇസ് Arun Arun Jor Yes big round of applause for Arun Arun ne kittanathu FIFA ada oru match ball aanu Arun ede team inde fan aanu Germany Germany team Yeah super if time allows njan orikil koodi ee stage il varunnundavum nal thank you so much for all your support thank you so much
A very, very good evening to everyone out here. Not good for any of you. Good evening. Good evening. Wow, that's great. So, uh, a very warm welcome. Guests are just arriving. We are still expecting one or two persons, so we should be starting in about a couple of minutes' time. But I think you are enjoying the show, right? I think there was an amazing performances which is happening since morning. You all been enjoying or not? Looks like you just had lunch. It's a late lunch. Very sleepy. Yes or no? That's weaker. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> we'll, we'll get into the proceedings soon. Team, are we ready? No. Okay. So we'll give them another couple of minutes and then we'll start on. Anu. We request all of you to kindly come forward. If you're standing outside, please do come fill up the seats because we've got an amazing program lined up for you. We've got distinguished guests also here. Please request all of you to come and fill up the seats. Can we all have the backbenchers coming a little ahead, please? And we are not starting until you all come ahead. Yes, we're going to stand here and wait for all of you to come to the front. Thank you, Juden. Thank you. Just, Thank just you. get Thank all of them ahead, please. And there are quite a few people still outside the auditorium. Can you please enter the auditorium and sit in the first five or six rows, please? Okay, so I think it's time that we start. Now, to start a, a, such an amazing evening, not just with any speeches, we'll be starting with a beautiful dance from Sands Dance World. Sands Dance World. And it is for the song, they are uh, dancing for the song Ishq Sufiana. Sands Dance World on stage with a Sufi performance. Put your hands together for them, please.
wonderful performance by the Sandstance World. You can do better than that. Give them a better applause. Come on. They've done a wonderful job. Thank you so much.
Our guests have arrived and we will be starting shortly. So once again, warm a very good evening and a warm welcome to all our distinguished guests and esteemed members who is present out here. Your MCs for the evening as myself, Anu Panil Devan and my co-host will be Anu Pramod. Tonight, we have the prestigious and scintillating Gulf Arts and Leadership Academy Awards in line with the gala's mandate to promote leadership and culture question of our society by recognizing excellence in a wide spectrum of fields. The day-long event held in association with members of the World Malayali Council Women's Forum, All, in, All Kerala Colleges Alumni Forum, ACAF, and Rotary Club Dubai Downtown is culminating in honoring achievers and leaders in UAE and India. In the, at the award ceremony, several outstanding thought leaders including leading entrepreneurs, artists, academicians, and writers from Arab world and India will be honored with accolades and citations in the presence of an allied crowd. Distinguished Emiratis and eminent personalities from India will be gracing the event. The UAE National Day Gala Awards will be given for those who excel in five categories. These include environment, philanthropy, business and innovation, community services, and literature and performing arts. The National Day Awards and Cultural Night has been designed to be a differently refreshing, entertaining program blending the sublime beauty of performing arts with thought-provoking intellectual experiences. All of you would have seen we've had two rounds of the World Malayali Queen 2022 dazzling beauty pageant. You will have the finale and some cultural programs lined up for this evening. All our guests are here and so we request all of you to kindly rise as we play the national anthems of United Arab Emirates as well as India. Kindly rise for the national anthems. And with that, 
we have officially commenced the UAE National Day Gala Awards Night. Now, it is our greatest honor to invite Dr. Isaac John Patani Parambal for the welcome speech. I request Mr. V.S. Bijukumar, General Secretary, ACAF, and Milana Ajit, Secretary, Sharjah WMC Women's Forum, to usher Dr. Isaac to the stage. Dr. Isaac John Patani Parambal is the chairman of Gulf Arts and Leadership Academy. He is also the senior most Indian journalist in the Middle East, managing editor of Khalid Times, past global president and chairman of World Malayali Council, chief patron, founder, and former president of the All Kerala Colleges Alumni Forum, or ACAF, and he is also the global ambassador of GOPIO, Global Organization of People of Indian Origin. And now, Dr. Isaac is being presented with a bouquet of roses by Mrs. Sheba Biju from WMC Dubai. Mr. Isaac John, Mr. Isaac John, managing editor of the Khalid Times, is one of the most high profile and well connected overseas Indian journalists in the Middle East. As the senior most Indian journalist with just over 41 years experience, Mr. Isaac has made his mark both in the print and visual media as a prolific writer, economic analyst, political and business commentator and a television host through both English and Malayalam media. Mr. Isaac's Symphony Global Indian television series providing highly successful global business tycoons on Amrita TV and e-vision channels has been a popular hit with viewers for its inspirational influence. He's also a frequent commentator on regional, social and economic issues on Indian televisions and radio. Respected for his invigorating and insightful analysis of global and regional businesses and economic issues and trends, he has to his credit more than 12,500 bilingual published articles and over 40 awards. Currently, Mr. Isaac is the Global Ambassador of GOPIO, Chairman of GALA, Global Advisory Board Chair of World Malayali Council, Chief Patron, Founder and Former President of All Kerala Colleges Alumni Forum or ACAF and Patron of various other organizations. He has also served as Former President and Chairman of World Malayali Council. Let's welcome Mr. Isaac John. We invite Dr. Isaac John Patani Parambal, Chairman of GALA, for the welcome speech. Good evening to you all. A big welcome to all who are part of this August gathering where we are all gathered in one spirit, the spirit of celebrating UAE's 51st anniversary. UAE is 51 years old and I am 42 years. I mean, I am 42 years in UAE. So I have been seeing the breathtaking growth UAE has been, the journey of UAE. It was so spectacular that, you know, we have to marvel at it and salute the great visionary leaders who made it happen. I think that nowhere in the world any nation could prosper in such a breakneck speed UAE could achieve, not in the size of economy, in the, in the, in the, in the, in, in, if you look at any metrics, any indices, global indices, UAE is standing first. Recently I wrote a story about, in UAE, two cities, Dubai and Abu Dhabi, are the most friendly cities for expatriates like you and me. So, that's why, now we are, we have a reason, strong reason to celebrate UAE's National Day. And you may ask, what is GALA? GALA is a conceptual platform where it is a, with a self-proclaimed mandate of celebrating success, celebrating friendship, celebrating happiness, and acknowledging the successful leaders. While promoting various excellence 
activities in uh, in the field of arts, environment, or uh, filmmaking, even everything, literature. We have been doing since uh, 2001. Gala has been in, in promoting all these things. We have been very active, and we have been we have seen many celebrated, uh, literary luminous like uh, our f filmmakers uh, being honored in this platform. And today is a very special day. Why? Because we, it is coinciding with the UAE's National Day, and we have all the reasons to make such a beautiful celebration. Because at least we owe that to this great nation and its visionary, pragmatic, and proactive leadership. You know that, you know. We are blessed because we happen to be in UAE. See, in, you know, whenever we go, wherever we go, I have been traveling quite a lot, and when they say, when they hear the name of UAE or Dubai or Abu Dhabi, they look at me with amazement. So that is the way, you know, UAE has grown in such a short span of time. And uh, again, I salute the leadership of UAE, the missionary leadership who made our hi life happier. And uh, because, you know, this is the only nation where we had a, a minister for happiness, a minister for tolerance, and nowhere in the world, you know, this co coexistence of religions, communities, diaspora could uh, blend in such a way that, you know, no, it is unfair thing, you know, I don't want to go much about that. Now I will come to my duty. It, my duty is to welcome the distinguished guests here. First of all, I am very thrilled and excited and privileged. Our His Excellency, Humayt Ben Salam, he is the chairman of International Chambers of Commerce, UAE, <laughs> as well as Director General of uh, the Federation of UAE Chambers of Commerce. Give him a big round of applause. So his presence here makes a big difference because now UAE and India are on a path of uh, so much closer partnership. We have signed with the UAE SIPA, which itself shows that the comprehensive economic pa partnership, and like, uh, like people here sitting here, they all know that how deep-rooted our relationship are and how strong we are all, both this country. We are future-ready UAE and the economically powerful India is going to have a partnership for future growths, which is, there is no limit to it. Just as uh, our His Highness, the, our Vice President and Prime Minister said, for the race for excellence, there is no finish line, and the uh, sky is the limit for the growths. So likewise, UAE and India is on a strong path to grow, and uh, they are going to, their growth is going to be a turbocharged because of a lot of uh, bilateral agreements are in place. So His Excellency's presence here is, uh, uh, I, I acknowledge his presence and with gratitude. And uh, second, I would like to acknowledge the presence of Mrs. Paulo Rodriguez. Uh, she's a motivational symbol of woman empowerment and motherhood. She celebrates her motherhood. Give her, her a big... And uh, now I have to acknowledge the presence of uh, our uh, celebrity filmmaker. He is our pride of India, pride of Malayalis. He is an international icon, Adur Gobalakrishnan. <laughs> Patma Bibushan, Adur Gobalakrishnan, he has uh, received the second highest civilian honor from India. And everyone, everywhere in the in international film field, he has made his mark, and uh, and his presence makes a huge difference for Gala. Ad Adurji, our salutations to you. Thank you. Welcome. Now we have with us Hussein Al Jasiri, the governor elect of the district, Rotary district, which I am also a part of it. Salutations to you, and uh, now Ahmed Velsala. Yes, he is the general manager of Rotary Association, Dubai, and a bedrock, and our patron, and you know, whenever we want any problems to be solved, he is there us to help us, guide us, shepherd us. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your presence. 
Now, another illustrious son of UAE, Emirati, is none other than Major Ali Sakar Sultan Al Suwedi. He has done such an exemplary work which nobody can match for to preserve the planet and uh, for the preservation of marine life. And uh, no, he is also, he belongs to the last generation of divers, spare divers. That is what I came to understand. Now he is teaching the new generation to how to dive for pearl. So that he was uh, humorously saying, when the revenue from oil stops, you know, you can find a living. So he was saying, and he is spearheading such a marvelous environmental uh, initiative in the UAE. And uh, I salute, he is one of the awardees who is going to be honored. Thank you, sir. Now, my friend and a big business entrepreneur, Faisal Kutikolon, he is a pioneer trailblazer. He is not, he, I think, you know, he hasn't made, he is not, not at arrived. And uh, I welcome him to this August gathering. Yes, and uh, another big guy, big at heart, like his persona, he is Yasin Al Jafar. He is my friend and a magnanimous personality, so large hearted like his persona. Large hearted. Thank you, sir. Thank you for being with us. He is also going to be awarded for philanthropy. And now, my friend, a long time friend, Ram Buxani. He is my guru as well. He is here. He is a doyen of Indian diaspora, not only in the UAE, but internationally. Because he has been living here, spending his time more than 60 years here, Ram Buxani, sir. 62 years in UAE, in the UAE. So he is much older than uh, uh, Ahmad Salah, <laughs> Ahmad Bel Salah. <laughs> anyway, Bhushan Sahib, thank you for making it. And uh, then uh, another word is the Tariq Chauhan. He is the CEO of, group CEO of EFS Facility Services. It's a big organization which has grown exceptionally well, remarkably well. And I think, you know, he is employing more than 25,000 people here. Am I correct? He has shown such a brilliant, oh, he has a brilliant track record for business stewardship, leadership. And uh, we have to salute him today. We have to honor him. Thank you. Thank you for with us, Tariq. Now, another celebrity filmmaker, Emirati poet, script writer and uh, you, know, you know her, you just Google and her name is there. Nujum Al Ghanam. Madam, we are honored with your presence. Thank you. Welcome to this Gaugas gathering. Then we have other awardees. My friend and uh, one of the famous prolific writers, John Shamel is here. And uh, he is here. I welcome you, sir. Then uh, I, I have my friend Sandoshwar is here, sitting here. He is the vice president of Toshiba Gulf, you know, which is a rare status or job for a non-Japanese to hold here. So he has been running the show for so many years. And under his uh, stewardship, Toshiba or all other Toshiba products were gaining market share here. And salute to you, Sandosh. Thank you for your presence here. Also, Sajit, my friend and innovator. He is very innovative. Sajit, you are very innovative. Young guy, please stand. The, his size is small, but his contributions to UAE's innovative thinking, its global market uh, presence, or all make him such a marvelous guy, very remarkable guy. Thank you for being with us. Now I have with us, see, I represent uh, three, four organizations here. But one is a global organization of people of Indian origin, whose president, Mr. Sunny Kulathakal, is here, global organization, which is uh, a United Nations accredited organization. He is there. 
and I also belong to World Malayali Council, an organization which has uh, presence across 77 cities in the world, all six continents. Global Chairman, Mr. Joni Kurula is here. Joni, welcome, welcome to you. And uh, I am now also part of World Malayali Council. I was the Global Chairman and President for six years. Now Joni is in my place. Joni, thank you very much. And uh, also, Brother Buddhani, he, he has come. Oh, yes. Another Rotarian, and uh, he's our uh, assistant district governor, Bharat Bhutani. He's also a long time resident of UAE and uh, former IBPC president. Thank you for your presence here. I think uh, now Sajit uh, Nasir, Nasir Velil, Velil, he's the chairman of BRB, BRW Group. He's, he's also very innovative and very successful businessman who made his mark within a short time, and he is now running a big business empire, and very generous, magnanimous, very generous, like a philanthropist. He has been active in many fields, and now uh, Father Paul Povathur is also here. Please, Father, he is known as a singing priest. Singing priest, very celebrated guy, very singer, and uh, also a philosopher, and a very inspirational guy. I welcome you, and all my friends from World Malayali Council, GoPO, All Kerala Colleges Alumni Forum, which is an organization exceptionally strong one with uh, representing the former college students of 161 colleges, which means symbolically ACAF represents all Kerala educated people working here. So uh, Charles Paul is here, is president, chairman uh, uh, Shahul Hamid is there, then uh, our senior leaders like Varghis Panakal, he's also going to be uh, awarded. Varghis Panakal is a businessman and philanthropist. I'm not taking much of his, your time. And uh, our friends from USA, from, from James Kudal, lot of other people are here, Paul uh, Vadasheri, and a uh, lot of others are here. I, I don't want to uh, spend much of the time for this. Anyway, hearty, warm welcome to all of you. And uh, come on, enjoy. Enjoy the evening. There are going to be very, uh, very, very, very exciting, riveting entertainments like uh, riveting dance. Then the finale of the fashion show, or not the fashion show, the beauty pageant is going to be here. So be ready for that. Enjoy the evening. Thank you very much. Thank you, Dr. Isaac John Patani Parambil. We have with us His Excellency. Kumed Ben Salem, Chairman of International Chambers of Commerce, UAE, and the Secretary of the Federation of UAE Chambers as our chief guest for the day. May I request Mr. C.U. Matai, Global Vice President of World Malayali Council, and Mrs. Esther Isaac, President of WMC Middle East Women's Forum, to usher the chief guest onto the stage for his inaugural address. His Excellency is also a former member of the UAE National Assembly, that's the parliament, where he played a significant role from 2012 to 16. Prior to that, he was the Director General of Umal Kwain Chamber of Commerce and Industry for 20 years. He has been at the Board of Directors of International Chamber of Commerce, UAE, since 2009 and was the elected chairman in 2015 to represent, support and protect the interest of the business community in the UAE. May I request Dr. Bharat Bhutani of Rotary Club to present the chief guest with a bouquet. Thank you, Dr. Bharat. And now, may I request His Excellency Humayd bin Salem for the inaugural speech. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah wa barakatuh. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. 
it's really an honor for me to be here with you today in this uh, wonderful event, Gala Award and Culture Night. And the uh, occasion is coming at parallel time with the 51st UAE National Day. My friend, Isaac Jones, he said so much good things about the United Arab Emirates and uh, the time that he, the 42 years he spent. He is younger than UAE, I'm not sure I'm younger than UAE, I'm about the same, the same age, I would say. Uh, when we speak about leadership, you know that United Arab Emirates have so much is being done to promote and to encourage leadership. And there are so many programs in the United Arab Emirates for leadership. And this occasion, National Day and leadership, we must remember an extraordinary leader who about 60 years ago had a vision and that vision was to unite seven emirates to become a country that when we look back and the nation's years that 50 years, as you all know, is not much and not a long time to build a country. It is really uh, a short time to have a country like UAE. When you compare the 50 years to what the UAE accomplished, I think that's a wonderful job. Our father, Sheikh Zayed, had a vision and since the beginning of the United Arab Emirates, the beginning of UAE as a country, he welcomed everybody to the UAE. My friend Isaac said something that expert and who's living here in UAE feel great and uh, feel they are welcome in the, in the country. And that's been done through the years since the beginning of this year, uh, of the beginning of the establishment of the United Arab uh, Emirates, I remember one time when Sheikh Zayed said that whoever would like to come to the UAE is most welcome. We work hand in hand and we develop this country, we build this country. Now we have more than 200 nationalities living in the United Arab Emirates. We are very proud of that. And Mr. Jones said something about the relationship between United Arab Emirates and India. I would like to say a little bit about that. He mentioned the comprehensive economic agreement that we have signed with India. Just to give you a little bit of how important the relationship, especially in business, when we talk about business, between India and United Arab Emirates. This is the first country to sign with UAE. So always, when you start something new, you look to the closest and you look to the most important country first. Then other follows. So many Partnerships between Indians and UAE are through the last 50 years has happened on this land. Great partnership. We always look to India as a friend and as an important partner and always trying to make the bilateral trade higher and higher by having more agreement and more enablers. 
With that said, I'm glad again and honored to announce the inauguration of the Gala Award and Culture Night 2022. Thank you and good evening. Thank you so much, sir, for that enlightening speech. Now, we have our national day today. So, to celebrate that, we have another Bollywood set, set of Bollywood divas right here from Sands Dance World. Thank you.
Volo Dance. Thank you, Sans Dance World, for that scintillating performance. We now commence with the awards. The UAE National Day Gala Awards, again, to right rate, are given to those who excel in five categories, environment, philanthropy, business and innovation, community services, and literature and performing arts. These awards will be presented in two sessions. The first session will have the awards in the performing arts, business and innovation, philanthropy, and environment categories, while the awards for the business services and literature category would be given during the second session. Okay, now, first up, we have the Gala International Creative Icon Award. The recipient of the Gala International Creative Icon Award for the year 2022 is Patma Vipushan, Dr. Abdur Gobalakrishnan. Now, may I request Mr. Vinish Mohan and Mrs. Rani Lijesh to usher Padma Vibhushan Adur Gobalakrishnan onto the stage to receive the award. Dr. Isaac John, we request you to please accompany Aduji to the stage. May we request our chief guest, His Excellency Humayd bin Salim, Mr. Ahmad Belsala and Dr. Ram Baksani also to come to the stage. Let me also request Mr. Santosh Vergis, Vice President, Toshiba Gulf FCD, and Mr. Shyam Vishwanath, Chairman of Al Milad Group of Companies, to be on the stage. Adurji is an internationally acclaimed filmmaker who has been bestowed with countless accolades and honors, including India's second highest civilian honor, Padma Vibhushan during 50 years of an illustrious filmmaking career. Mr. Gopalakrishnan is India's pride and an icon. It is a proud privilege for Gala to honor Mr. Adur Gopalakrishnan with the Gala International Creative Icon Award for his exceptional lifetime contributions to the film industry. We will now watch a short video on Adurji. Shri Adu Gopalakrishnan, one of India's most acclaimed contemporary filmmaker who was born in Kerala in 1941 into a family that patronized Kathakali and other classical performing arts. From the age of eight, he began acting for the stage, later producing and directing over 20 plays, several of them written by him. He was also one of the leading figures in the New India Cinema movement of realistic and issue-based filmmaking that arose in the 70s. Sri Adur Gopalakrishnan is one of the finest filmmakers of India and has played an important role in revolutionizing Malayalam cinema. He has won Dada Sahib Falke Award and many other national and state awards for his works. He was conferred with the Patma Shri in 1984 and the Patma Vibhushan in 2006. He was also honored with the Commander of the Order of Arts and Letters, the highest award for proficiency in arts given by the French government. International Film Critics Prize, six times consecutively. Award for the most original imaginative film in the British Film Institute Awards of 1982. J.C. Daniel Award. Lifetime Achievement Awards at the Cairo, Denver, New Jersey, Colombo Film Festivals. Sri Adul Gopalakrishnan was also conferred with honorary doctorates delit by Mahatma Gandhi University, Kerala University and Vishwabharati Universities. Some of his famous works include Swayamvaram, Mukhamukam, Nalipanikal, Anandaram and Videyan. His directorial venture, Swayamvaram, is considered to be a milestone movie in the Indian film history. Every character designed by Sri Adur Gopalakrishnan has turned out to be 
the most coveted characters in the history of Indian cinema. Let's welcome the legend himself to kindly come forward to receive our love and honors. We would also like to honor Mr. Ahmed Belsala by presenting a bouquet to him by Mrs. Asha Charles. And to Dr. Ram Baksani by Mrs. Mercy Matthews. Gala Chairman Dr. Isaac John Patani Parambal presents the award to Adurji. A loud round of applause, please. I am overwhelmed by one thing. While you know, we were discussing how who should give the award to this such an illustrious personality, we were discussing, and I said, you know, I couldn't invite that guy, this guy, very senior people. Adurji said, Isaac. You please give me the award. You are the chairman of Gala. So I am so humbled and uh, I, I couldn't express uh, how. And also my friend uh, John Shamil also said, that is the correct way. But in the presence of all these eminent people, you know, I am very happy and very pleased to oblige the request made by Adurji. Adurji, thank you very much. This is the most important moment of the evening possibly today. Can we have a big round of applause when he is presenting the award to the one and only Dr. Adur Gobalakrishnan. Mr. Santosh Varghese of Toshiba will present Mr. Adurji with a ponada. And Mr. Sham Vishwanath will hand over the cash award to Adurji. Thank you, Mr. Santosh and Mr. Sham Vishwanath. You may kindly return to your seats. We request Dr. Isaac, His Excellency Humaid bin Salim, Mr. Ahmed Belsala, and Dr. Ram Baksani to remain on stage as we eagerly await to hear from Adurji. A few words from you, please. Very honorable and very dear friends. This has been a very memorable day because for morning we have been discussing Kerala's culture and arts. In the afternoon we have been witnessing uh, cultural programs. And, uh, and almost towards the end, uh, we are, uh, you know, I am getting an award, and this is very important, of course. And from you, uh, <coughs> Gala is very well known as a very discreet organization who selects awardees with great care, 
and great uh, uh, precision, I must say. So uh, to receive an award from Gala is not a small award. It's a, it's a very big award. And it, it is given with so much love and affection. That I consider very important. Uh, this, this afternoon, this forenoon, we have been talking about how enterprising the, the Keralites are. So, uh, from actually, we have at least one person from each family working in the Middle East. And most of them are in the UAE. So, um, we, we are very closely uh, connected and we are, in fact, indebted to the, to the UAE uh, uh, government for the kind of uh, um, appreciation, encouragement, and uh, the opportunities given to Malayalis particularly. Of course, there are so many other Indians also working here, no doubt about it. But uh, this is what I know very closely because every one of us has one or two relatives working in, in, the, in the United uh, Arab uh, Republics. <coughs> so this is a very, this has been a very great honor, which has been a great day for me. And I thank everybody uh, involved in the organization. Because we, it's, it's very, very uh, appropriate that we are celebrating the anniversary, 51st anniversary of uh, the UAE uh, on this day. And very, with, with, again, with a lot of uh, uh, love, friendship, and affection. I remember in 1969, I was going to the United States on a scholarship uh, offered by the Rockefeller Foundation uh, to, to attend an international uh, design conference. And I remember those days, the flights, it was very easy to board a flight and travel. So I had a Panam ticket, and then the first stopover was in, in Dubai. And in Dubai, there were some sh shed-like structures. That was the airport. And look at Dubai today. Look at Sharjah today. And I've been coming to these places very often. And the, the, the way these places have been transformed from nothing except the sand so that was there. It is, it, is, it is a salute to the human dignity, <laughs> endeavor, you know, the, the retirement in the, in the minds, you know, it's a remarkable thing, you know. I, I have seen this transformation happening to, to the United Arab uh, <laughs> Republics. So, um, and we just now reached the, the, the uh, it is one of the, f the first world, you know, while we are trying to be st to get out of the third world back in india no we will surely we be, be going forward you know, we are not going backward our our um, our people are also very industrious and only thing is their industry and, uh, and dedication and the, the kind of uh, uh, faithfulness to the uh, work etc they are seen more once the people are outside the country. Now, this is a very interesting thing. You don't see this enterprise back, back home. It is seen once they come out. So there is a saying that uh, the, once you take, the, uh, take an international flight for a job abroad, then, the, then the, your destiny changes and your attitude changes, your character changes. So let us keep this character. Let us be loyal to the place where we are working. Let us you know, work for its pro prosperity. We feel proud that you have you also contributed to its pro prosperity through, the, through your endeavor. So I am, I am particularly, uh, I feel particularly privileged to be uh, receiving this prize in the presence of the His Excellency and others. Uh, thank you very much. Thank you once again. Thank you so much, Adurji. Thank you so much for your wonderful words.
you may kindly return to your seat. Do you need help? Yes. Thank you, thank you, Adurji. It is a honor and it is also not a coincidence that Adurji is uh, celebrating 50 years of uh, illustrious filmmaking career and UAE is also celebrating 50 years of spectacular, breathtaking growth. Thank you, thank you for the, I mean, it's a happy coincidence. Thank you. Uh, thank you so much. So next up on Gulf Arts and Leadership Academy Lifetime Achievement Award to, for 2022 being presented to Major Ali Sakar Sultan Al Suwaidi. Major Ali is Sakar Ali is the pres Major Sakar Ali is the president of Emirates Marine and Environmental Group and secretary of the board of directors Emirates Nature WWF. May I request Mr. Baby Vergis, treasurer of Rotary Club of Dubai Downtown, and Mrs. Rani Sudhir, chairperson of Akaf Ladies Wing, to usher Major Ali Sakar Sultan Al Suwaidi to receive the Gala Lifetime Achievement Award for his exemplary leadership initiatives in environment preservation. Let's have the audio visual, please. Ali Sakar Al Suwedi. Major Ali Sakar Al Suwedi, the President of Emirates Marine Environmental Group. Major Ali Sakar Al Suwedi is a pioneer in safeguarding the nation's maritime heritage. He is also the Secretary of Board of Directors of Emirates Nature WWF. Under his unprecedented guidance and leadership, the EMEG has launched numerous wildlife protection programs especially ones specifically focused on preserving maritime habitat. His visions of preserving wildlife and maritime habitat led to the creation of the Rasal Kohl Wildlife Sanctuary and the Jabalali Marine Sanctuary. Major Ali Sakar Al Suwedi has five research works with 99 citations which include underwater video surveys. Major Ali Sakar Al Suwedi is a well known figure leading conservation and protection of endangered sea turtles across the seven Emirates and Gulf Islands. He is also recognized as the UAE's last pearl diver. His interactions with the late President and the Father of the Nation, His Highness Sheikh Zayed bin Sultan Al Nahyan, led to a revolutionary management and safeguarding of the marine wildlife in the nation. We welcome Major Ali Sakar Al Suwedi to receive the honors. Major Ali is being presented with a bouquet by Ms. Danya Isaac. Thank you, Danya. Now, thank you. Now, may we request uh, His Ex Excellency Humayd bin Salim uh, to present the award and Dr. Baksani to honor the awardee with the Ponada. First, His Excellency Humayd bin Salim to present the award to Major Ali. Now we request Mr. Ram Baksani, Dr. Ram Baksani to uh, present him up with a ponada.
Thank you, thank you so much, sir. Now we request Dr. Isaac, uh, His Excellency Humayd bin Salam, Mr. Ahmed Belsala, and Mr. Rambaksani to remain on stage as we invite Major Ali for his acceptance speech. Major Ali, please. Uh, it's my pleasure, uh, really, uh, in this special day, our national day, uh, to come and celebrate with everybody, especially our friend from India. Uh, really, you know, I have many stories, really, about, uh, you know, how we live in this country. You know, our country, we have desert and we have the salt water. It's very hard to live in this environment. Our grandfather, our uh, grandmother, they are, you know, work very hard really to live in this country. And always the help come from India. One of the amazing thing happened, you know, uh, between Emirat and India. Uh, I think everybody know uh, Tata Ratan. Tata Ratan, he's the first, you know, Indian come to Dera, and he's friend of my grandfather. Now, when the second war come, <laughs> yes, he is a great guy really. When the second war happened, it's no food, you know, a big problem. And uh, my grandfather decided to go to Bombay to bring food from there. And Tata Ratan, he gave him a letter and signing with his uh, stamp. He said, if the British don't let you have more food, go to the Maharaja. And you know, Maharaja is like a sheikh in India. Uh, they start going from here, you know, sailing because no engine before. When they come to Muscat, they told them, you cannot cross because the German submarine is there. And my grandfather, he said, no, tawakkal ala Allah, I will go. And you know, uh, he took the flag, Dubai flag, and he put pill diving flag, which is a green flag. And you know, they came to uh, Salala and the submarine rise, when sh they saw the green uh, flag, they did them go. Now, when they reached to Bombay, you know, the, the Indian, they throw rice on you because this is a good luck, how you cross, because most of the boat which is coming from Kuwait and Bahrain, they hit by the submarine. Now, when they come to buy, you know, food, uh, they went to the Maharaja, and they show him the letter from Tata Ratan, and really, you know, next day, he brought more than 7,000 basmati rice, and you know, basmati rice is not easy, you know. <laughs> he filled our boat with food, with medicine, with everything. And my grandfather is waiting to pay money. He said, no, this is free for Dubai and for Tata Ratan. And this is the amazing thing, really. You know, we're getting word from you a long time, but now, you know, more than 50 or 60 years. Really, uh, you know, I'm so happy today uh, to meet everybody here, especially my friend, you know, they are uh, in Rotary Club. And uh, in my organization, you know, we start 1995, we have you know, many professors from India. We just have one for Kara Reeves, and Dr. Shahad, he's also from India. Many professors, and that's how the good connection really uh, between India uh, and the Emirat. And we really appreciate that because you came to help this country, and we are really so happy to see you coming to help our country, and now Dubai is the best town in the world. And Emirat, for me, is the best <laughs> really in the world. One of the amazing things happened, thank you. One of the amazing thing happened, you know, before on pearl diving is very hard, you know. Nobody buy our pearls only to go to India. And if you look to the names of the pearl diving, most of them from India. And this is amazing, you know, how to go to Bombay and sell, you know, our, and Ratan, he's the best guy. He took the pearls, sell it, and he bring it to everybody. Same, he's very honest, this guy. Really, we are very proud to him. One of the amazing thing happened, you know, in pearl diving, always he's singing. I want you to sing with me, please. Wa alayhi wa alayhi. Wa alayhi wa alayhi. Wa alayhi wa alayhi. Wa alayhi wa alayhi. We love you. <laughs> this is amazing, you know. Love you is very important. <laughs> For us and MEG, love you is a very important word. Anybody make mistake, we told them, I love you. And nobody shout when somebody make mistake. I hope everybody also, you know, 
of these rules because I love you is very nice word. Thank you very much, really. I am so happy to meet everybody. Thank you. We love you too, sir. Thank yes, you so much. Thank you so much. May I invite Mr. Hussein Al Jaziri, Governor elect of Rotary District, to kindly grace us on the stage? We now have the Gala Changemaker Icon Award 2022 which is being presented to Mr. Faisal Kotikolun, Chairman of KEF Group. May we request Mr. Anil Kumar, Treasurer, WMC Sharja Province, and Mira Varghis, WMC Dubai Province, to usher Ms. Renjini onto the stage. Mr. Faisal, unfortunately, could not make it here today. Ms. Renjini will receive the award on his behalf. Mr. Anil Kumar and Ms. Mira Varghese. May we also request Mrs. Paula Rodriguez, celebrated Colombian-born Emirati aesthetic consultant, and Ms. Janet Varghese, global president of WMC Women's Forum, to come onto the stage with the awardee. Mr. Faisal is being awarded for his exceptional leadership qualities as an innovative entrepreneur and initiatives in wellness and the healthcare sector. He is a member of the Indian Prime Minister's prestigious panel of champions of change for infrastructure. He has been named one of the top 100 Indian business leaders in the Arab world by the Forbes Middle East and was listed by Arabian Business as one of the 100 most powerful Indians in the Gulf. He is also the co-founder of the Faisal and Shibana Foundation, which seeks to create sustainable initiatives. We will now watch a two-minute video on Mr. Faisal. Mr. Faisal Kodukla. Mr. Faisal Edabalathu Kotiklon is a UA-based Indian entrepreneur and philanthropist. He is the chairman and founder of KEF Holdings, chairman of the board Mitra Hospital and co-founder Faisal and Shabana Foundation. Mr. Faisal Kotiklon was named one of the top 100 business leaders in the Arab world by Forbes Middle East and as one of the 20 most influential leaders in Gulf construction by Construction Week. Apart from being a successful and influential entrepreneur, Mr. Faisal is a well-known philanthropist in the region. In 2007, Mr. Faisal and his wife, Mr. Shabana, established the Faisal and Shabana Foundation with the vision of giving to create impact. In 2017, Mr. Faisal established Mitra Hospital, KEF Healthcare's first tertiary care hospital in Kodikod, Kerala. History was bought alive at Magna Carta House when KEF Holdings, through Faisal and Shabana Foundation, signed the 2022 Responsible Tourism Charter in November 2022. The charter was signed on the same table on which Magna Carta was signed in 1215 by King John. Mr. Faisal and Mrs. Shabana, along with their daughter Sarina, became the only persons to sign this charter as a family. They were joined by persons from 13 countries. Ms. Sarna became the youngest person globally to sign the charter. Mr. Faisal Kotiklon, a successful businessman and a relentless philanthropist who serves for the upliftment of society, is a role model to be admired and followed on. Let's welcome Mr. Faisal Kotiklon to receive the honors. Ms. Renjuni is being presented. 
presented with a bouquet by Anu Ravindran. May we request Mrs. Paula to please present the award to Ms. Ranjani. And Mrs. Janet to honor the awardee with a ponada. Ms. Ranjani, would you be speaking a few words? Please. Ms. Ranjani. Good evening, everyone. Um, as introduced, I'm Ranjani Korean. I work with Mr. Faisal Kotikulon. Unfortunately, due to travel commitment, he was not able to make it here. So it's an absolute honor to be representing him, the company, and the organization, and absolute honor to accept this on his behalf. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Isaac. Thank you, everyone who's gathered here. Thank you. Thank you so much, Ms. Ranjani. Thank you, Mrs. Paula. Thank you so much. Now, the Gala Philanthropy Icon Award for the year 2022 goes to Mr. Yasin Mohammed Jaffer, Chairman, Proclad Academy for his general generous philanthropic contrib contributions. Now, may we request Ms. Reshmi Vinesh of Sarja WMC Women's Forum and Mr. Judin Fernandez, Treasurer Akaf, to usher Mr. Yasin Mohammed Jaffer onto the stage. We also request Mr. Sandosh Verghese, Mr. James Koodle, Treasurer, WMC Global, and Mr. Feroz Abdullah, Director, Air Master Group of Companies, to accompany Mr. Yasin onto the stage. And now, may we have the video, please? Mr. Yasin M. Jaffer. Mr. Yasin M. Jaffer, Group CEO of Proclad Group of Companies. Mr. Yasin's vision and determination has led to Proclad's ongoing investment and acquisition strategy that has seen the group grow to its current position with headquarters in Dubai and state-of-the-art manufacturing facilities in the UAE, UK, Europe and Indonesia. He has spent the last 30 years in Dubai and has committed to increasing UAE's industrial sector's contribution to GDP and promoting superior made in UAE products in global markets in collaboration with the UAE government's national in-country value program. Apart from being a successful professional, Mr. Yasin M. Jaffer is also a great humanitarian and an eminent philanthropist in the region who has been constantly working with the Al Jalila Foundation a member of the Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum Global Initiative to support the Hamdan bin Rashid Cancer Charity Hospital. He has pledged the Rams 10 million for the construction of pioneering Dubai Cancer Hospital to commemorate his wife's own battle with the disease. Mr. Yassin, in his own words, say that he was determined to play his part in the fight against cancer to thank the healthcare workers who supported his family during their time of need. Mr. Yasin M. Jaffer is also the president of Rotary Club, where he has emphasized and worked hard along with his efficient team towards helping those in need. For his efforts and unparalleled contribution towards the society, Mr. Yasin has been awarded with the prestigious Paul Harris Fellow Award by Rotary International and European Global Leadership Award. Besides being the group CEO of Proclad Group, Mr. Yasin is also the chairman of the board of the United Caspar Group in UK, chairman of BI Group UK, 
Board of Director of Crescent Engineering FZC and Chairman of the Board of Green Crescent LLC. A role model, philanthropist and a humanitarian, Mr. Yassin's service to the society is unparalleled and an inspiration to the younger generation who wishes to follow his footsteps. Let's welcome Mr. Yassin Jaffa to receive the honors. Mr. Yassim Jaffer, Yassim Jaffer is being presented with a bouquet by Anne Vijish. Thank you. And now may we, may we request H. E. Humaid Ben Salem to present the award and Mr. James Kudel to adorn him with the ponada. Thank you, thank you very much. And uh, now, may we request Mr. Yasin to say a few words to all the guests, and we request all the guests to remain on stage. So, please. Thank you very much. Good evening. First of all, we have to congratulate UAE and the rulers for the 51th National Day. So, congratulations for all of us. Thank uh, Dr. Isaac for the arrangement and for putting us on the stage today and for the, uh, taking this in consideration. Thanks all uh, the people who made the effort to put this event together. Thank you very much. I am very honored with this. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mr. Yassin. As all the guests continue to remain on stage, we would like to call upon Mr. Ahmed Belsala to adorn Mr. Santosh Varghese with the Ponada for his contributions to the UAE. Mr. Ahmed Belsala to adorn Mr. Santosh Varghese with a panada for his contributions to the UAE. We also request Dr. Ram Baksani to adorn Mr. James Kudel with a ponada for his valuable contributions to UAE. And we request Mr. Santosh Varghese to adorn Mr. Feroz Abdullah with a ponada for his innovative entrepreneurial skills.
Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Mr. Santosh, Mr. James, Mr. Feroz. We now have the Gala Business Leadership Award for the year 2022, and the proud recipient is Mr. Tariq Chauhan, a professional entrepreneur with years of diverse experience in international banking, technology, asset management, and real estate. He is currently Group CEO of EFS Facilities Services Group and a member of EFS Board of Directors. We request Mr. Pratap Kumar and Litta Manoj of Rotary Club to usher Mr. Tariq Chauhan for receiving the Gala Business Leadership Award in recognition of his remarkable entrepreneurial achievements. We will now have a short video on Mr. Tariq. <laughs> Tariq Chauhan. Mr. Tariq Chauhan, a Harvard alumnus, an entrepreneur, and a well-known businessman with Indian roots. He is the group CEO and co-founder of EFS Group. He is hailed as a visionary business leader in the industry, having built EFS into an international conglomerate and a leading FM company at the global level. Mr. Tariq Chauhan is well acclaimed as a thought leader, writer, columnist, and a visionary in the global facilities management industry. His works in FM and business prudence is well acknowledged and he has authored over 100 plus articles in various publications, including his regular columns in major UA publications. He has written a book titled Getting to Wrestle in Mode, which is under publication by Forbes Books. Mr. Tariq is among the top CEOs ranked in 2021 and 22 by Forbes Middle East and was on the cover page of the July 22 publication of Forbes Middle East edition. He has also been listed multiple times as part of the top five Indian executives in the Forbes ranking. He is also ranked 12th among the top business leaders and ranked second in the FM Power 30 by Construction Business News. He was awarded the Innovative Leader of the Year and the Industry Leader of the Year by Innovation in Construction and FM Awards and nominated by GCC Government HR Awards as the People First Leader in 2021. For almost three decades, Mr. Tariq has been championing upskilling and welfare of frontline workers with his organization and on global platforms. He has established a first ever NGO, ABAR, dedicated to worker well-being. Mr. Tariq regularly participates in various forums as a speaker. He has participated in past seminars hosted by the International Facility Management Association, Oracle Open World 2019, Bangladesh Economic Forum, Microsoft Summit, the Federation of Indian Chambers of Commerce and Industry, the Harvard Indian Conference, the Indian Council for International Cooperation, and Pravasi Bharatiya Divas Convention, organized by the Ministry of External Affairs, India. We welcome Mr. Tariq Chauhan to receive the honors. Okay, by Miss Smitha Jain. We request Mr. Ahmed Belsala to present the award to Mr. Tariq Chauhan. And we request Mr. Hussein Al Jaziri to drape the Ponada. May we request Mr. Tariq Chauhan to share his secrets on how he became so successful.
Good evening, everybody. So when we talk about the secret, first I have to tell that I have got my wife here. And we've been married for 32 years. So uh, for all the support, she and having, uh, you know, brought up two young daughters. So I think that's a very important success being family, very critical to any sustainability. But today, this evening, when we talk about the UAE National Day and the Gala Awards and the large Malayali community present here, I'm a champion of resilience. And I must say, UAE and Malayalis both are one of the greatest champions of resilience. And I don't think uh, whatever over the years, what UAE has established a leadership, what the Malayalis, I employ about 23,000 people, and out of them, one third of them are Malayalis, and they are my preferred employees. So what I have to take from this award is a much larger responsibility and accountability. Uh, I'm really humbled by the, the gala uh, awards committee for choosing me for this day. And once again, thanking you all for uh, this award. Thank you. Please. Thank you so much, Mr. Tariq. Now we have the Gulf Art Gala Creativity Award for the year 2022 goes to Ms. Nujum Al Ghanim, Emirati poet, artist, scriptwriter, and multi award winning film director. She has produced 11 films so far. We request Ms. Nazila Ajman, WMC Women's Forum President, and Ms. Suchitra Pradap, Rotary Club Dubai Downtown, to usher Ms. Najum Al Ghanim on stage for receiving Gala Creativity Award in honor of, of her rich and varied contributions. May we also request Padma Vibhushan, Dr. Abu Adur Gobalakrishnan, Mrs. Omar and Margarita Poposki of Rotary Association Dubai to kindly come on stage. Salam, salam. We are waiting for Margarita Poposki of Rotary Association of Dubai. She's not there. Okay. Now, uh, Ms. Najum is being presented. Can you call Paula? Okay. May I call Ms. Paula? Paula Rodriguez on stage, please. Hmm? Hmm. Ms. Najum is being presented with a bouquet by Preeta Jacob. Of WMC Women's Forum Dubai province. Okay, now may we have a short video of Ms. Najum? Nujum Al Ghanem. Ms. Nujum Al Ghanem, a multidisciplinary poet, filmmaker, and a visual art creator. Her passion for words and colors were her first self discovery about art and literature. They led her later on to film production, which became her tools and language. She began her career as a journalist in the 1980s and throughout the past 30 years, she's been utilizing her talents in searching for extraordinary content, presenting unique stories and characters from this region to the world. Ms. Nujamal Ghanem is considered as one of the strongest modern Emirati poets and a multi-award winning film director. She has published eight poetry collections, produced 20 films, and presented her artworks in the most prestigious art platforms and museums around the globe. 
She's represented the UAE twice in Venice Binale and have her work shown in the Louvre Museum, the Museum of the Future, Al Itihad Museum, and many other cultural institutes. In 2019, Ms. Nujib received the Pride of UAE Medal from Mohammed bin Rashid Government Excellence Award. Her achievements have engraved her name amongst the most highlighted women in the region and as a creative artist, mentor, cultural consultant and a professional film instructor. In her own words, she still thinks that she's just an adventurist in the world of art. We welcome Ms. Nujum al to receive the honours. Now we request Aduji to present the award to Ms. Nujum. A big round of applause for her. Thank you. Now we request uh, Mrs. Paula Rodriguez and Ms. Margarita Poposki to drape the ponada. She's not there. She's not there. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. Now we would like to listen a few words from you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much. And um, it's an honor. I, I'm, in fact, I'm speechless. I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, it's a double honor tonight to receive this uh, recognition from a, a great, a great director. Uh, and also, it's a doubly honor to be on this day, a very special day to all of us as Emiratis, and I'm sure to all of you, the residents of the UAE. In such a day, it means a lot to me. I started in the early 80s, and I always wanted to be an artist, but uh, it wasn't easy to travel in that time, and also, my family, uh, especially my father, didn't allow me to travel, not because he didn't hate that, but because he was afraid of leaving me traveling alone. And I had to wait until I get married and I have my two children. Then I had the opportunity to travel abroad and to study. So it was a bit late for me to start and I've always asked myself, why do you have to wait all that time for your dreams to be accomplished? And today I am here standing among you, among all these great people who were recognized tonight. And I am becoming 60 years old. And you know, like when I heard a great person like Ador G, who, say, who, who has been in film making for 50 years, it makes me feel so humbled. And, and, you know, like, have hope that it is never too late to be recognized for what you do. And as I always say, we talk about. Uh, the years, uh, and I swear always that it was just yesterday, and I always ask myself why every time I count year, the years, another is added. Thank you so much, and thank you, Dr. Isaac John, for recognizing my work and for giving me this chance to be among you tonight. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Dunujum. And that comes to the first phase of the end of the first phase of the awards. But we are not done yet. We have a lot of more, uh, in a lot more exciting awards coming up. But before that, we are going into one more entertainment uh, section. We are going for the Sands Dance World's performance once again from Tallumala.
Maybe the stamina to be fighting curtains or it just went there. Babies with odd names, father or family roots. Harder it gets for them, ever just set for them high. <gasps> you keep walking back, it's like cover. You had to come back from behind and say you're covertly hover. You're coming back from all the mess like you know nothing does bother you. Where did you get all the color from the Nike who poverty? Your products all around, but poverty can real. Tap it even till make it look like monetary deals. Daffodils to kill, I used to get a put him in the face. You murderer, seems like you lost the people who you could have caught a further, but now you could go to God. Thank you so much. That was a great performance by Sans Dance World. Welcome back to World Malayali Queen. We are moving on to the grand finale. We are moving on to the grand finale. 
ബാക്ക് സ്റ്റേജിൽ റെഡി ആയിട്ട് നിൽക്കുന്നുണ്ട് അടുത്ത ഗ്രാൻഡ് ഫിനാലയിലേക്ക് പോകാൻ വേണ്ടിയിട്ട് ആൻഡ് വൺസ് അഗെയിൻ ഐ വെൽക്കം ഓൾ ദി ജഡ്ജസ് ശ്രീ വിവേക് മേനൻ സിനിമാറ്റോഗ്രാഫർ മിസ് നമൃത പ്രകാശ് മിസ്സസ് കേരള ട്വൻറ്റി ട്വൻറ്റി വൺ മിസ് ത്രീ ശ്രീ തുളസി മിസ് കേരള ടു ടു തൗസൻഡ് എയ്റ്റ് ഡോക്ടർ സ്മിത പ്രഭാകർ ഓൺട്രപ്രോണർ സോ എല്ലാവരെയും ഒരിക്കൽ കൂടി സ്വാഗതം ചെയ്യുകയാണ് നമ്മുടെ ഗ്രാൻഡ് ഫിനാലയിലേക്ക് എല്ലാവരും ഉഷാറല്ലേ വൈകുന്നേരം ആയപ്പോഴേക്കും ക്ഷീണമായോ കേൾക്കണില്ല ഒന്നും കേൾക്കണില്ല ഒന്ന് നന്നായിട്ട് കൈയടിച്ചേ അതായത് നമ്മുടെ ബാക്ക് സ്റ്റേജിൽ ഇരിക്കുന്ന ഓരോ കണ്ടസ്റ്റൻസിനും അതൊരു പ്രചോദനമാവട്ടെ ആൻഡ് വി ആർ മൂവിങ് ഓൺ ടു ദി ഗ്രാൻഡ് ഫിനാലെ ഓഫ് വേൾഡ് മലയാളി ക്വീൻ ഐ ഗൈസ് റെഡി യെസ് ഓൾ റൈറ്റ് ആൻഡ് the grand finale of world malayali queen is here
a huge round of applause to all the gorgeous contestants over here. It's so beautiful, isn't it? All right. So, 14 contestants are in the Yuri Vedil Matur Chada. Adil Nandam, second round lake, Thiranya de Capeta, eight pair Ironu, and third round lake, Adil Nandam again, Anji Pereana, number Thiranya de Titula, number judges Thiranya de Titula. And our uh, Anji Pere Pere, the end of the Kaila Padra might be given under judges or about a reward criteria. Okay, check it. Anji Pere and a finalized final round lake. It is another. And Anju Pera Irkum, final round il Malsarian Boganada, final round or a topic of Gorthita, Adine Kurchita, or a minute, aid the game, our minute till Adata or a minute till Adavaiki game chain the honor. And it's time to announce the result, not the final result. Third round lake, Araki Anna, Thirinjaka Petta, in the Darian Bogiana. Contestants, are you guys ready to hear the results? None that in the Kaitcher and Dundasite Lambda contestants. All right. Third round lake, Thirinjaka Petta, Adete contestant. Contestant number two. I invite contestant number two to the stage. Please be seated. And the next contestant, contestant number one. Congratulations. The third contestant, contestant number five. In the end of the day, because Anjabe Raikim is the grand finale, final round of match and Boganada. And the next contestant is contestant number seven. Please be seated. And the last contestant, the very last contestant who is qualified into the third round, which is the grand finale, it's none other than. Contestant number six. Bakila contestants are in the Sangata Penda. Namkuru Bad, subtitles, Mada Pola, the Nedu Bad, Asangal Walk in the Don't worry. So these are the finalists. Give them a huge round of applause. Before moving on to the topic, we have a fashion designer who is also, also a health con uh, consultant, Miss Paula. She likes to ask you some questions. Do you have the mic over there? Yeah. Okay, so good evening. How are you? Okay, um, my question to you is 
Uh, sorry to interrupt, ma'am. It's not for the uh, final round. It is just a question. Okay, it's not for the judgment. Okay, what makes you different? Different, sorry, uh, from the other girls participating today. And the question is to who, ma'am? Anyone? To anyone. Anyone can answer. Could you please repeat the question, ma'am? What makes you different from the other girls competing today? Um, I could say that I'm unique and confident enough to do this. Yeah. Okay. Hi, ma'am. Thank you for the question. Well, uh, to be honest, everyone is unique in their own way. And I am unique in my own way because I'm very curious about how this world works. And that makes me move forward. I do lots of activities at, I'm a multitasker. For example, I do work, I do my interior design, I go for fashion shows, I do classical dance, I do cooking. I also used to play chenda and all. So all these things and every day it makes me, you know, do, do different things and that makes me better. So that is why I'm unique. I don't like to sit at home. I just want to make myself busy every day. Thank you. Well, uh, hello, ma'am. What makes me unique is that I'm a very versatile person. I have many feathers in my cap. I'm a classical dancer. I'm a black belt holder in karate, and I'm also a model. I'm also an environmentalist. I'm a part of an environmental organization. Apart from that, I'm a very hard worker. I truly believe that with hard work, you can achieve anything you want. And there's, as long as you have the will to fight for what you truly believe in, there's nothing that you cannot achieve. And that's one quality that I believe sets me apart from the others in the competition. Thank you. Thank you for the question, ma'am. I think I believe in myself, and if I'm here today, it is because I would love to try new things and learn from it, experience each and every moment in life. And I believe that even this opportunity I have got today is completely so that I learn something new and I also keep in life and I can experience or reach greater heights. Thank you. Hi. Um, to come this far, it was not easy. So this is my first time. And to come this far is, takes courage and confidence. So, Everybody is unique in their own ways, but I feel that I'm very confident and I, I have a beautiful smile. Thank you. Any more questions, ma'am? All right. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you so much. We're moving on to the topic. So you'll have to write the answer in one minute and you'll have to read whatever is there in your paper. No, one minute. You'll, give, you'll have one minute time to write the answer. And you have to read out the, the answer, whatever you have written, OK? All right? Judges, can we have the question, please? Hello, contestants. Good evening. How is everyone doing? Great. Excited for the final round? And here you go. Here's a question. In your opinion, how well can women handle body shaming. Hmm. How would you approach it from your personal perspective? And how would you look at it if somebody else does it, like the media? You know, there's a lot of pressure, right? Your body has to be this way, or slim, or fat, whatever it is. So how do you handle that situation? Is the topic clear? No, you, you have a question. Could you please repeat it once again? In your opinion, how would you handle body shaming? For example, people ask models to be in a in specific way. You need to be slim, you need to look anorexic, you need to be a particular way, right? So that's a pressure for all the people, not just models, for anybody out there. So how do you handle the situation? Are you comfortable in your body? Or how would you go about it? What's your take on it? Please Is don't it start. Clear? Is Until the time is, yeah. Go ahead. Your time starts Is the question now. clear? And your time starts now. The timer, please.
and the time is up. One minute is over, guys. Madhi, can you? All right. Done, 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 done. The exam center le paper me na ka mangna wale mangne ro. Done. Okay. And shall we start from here? Okay. I think uh, I would not let that slide. I think I would not let that slide. I'm proud to be in whatever body shape I am in. So in media industry, if it happens, I can't let that slide. It's not written, so I got to stop there. So yeah, that's my answer. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. My answer to this question is, I handle such situation by ignoring their sentence and giving awareness about how much it hurts a person. I'll say back with, with full confidence that every woman are beautiful and unique in their own way. If everyone is same, how would world become unique? Thank you. As someone who has experienced body shaming, I know exactly how dis disheartening it is. It took me a while to become the confident person I am, comfortable and confident in my own skin. The best way is to constantly work on yourselves and always ignore other people's judgments. Thank you. So the answer to this question, which I have written was, I think all women are different and beautiful in their own ways. So body shaming is supposed to be removed from the society. Women should be happy or comfortable for whom they are and they should not be disappointed if you face it in life. Thank you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I turned a blind eye to what people think about me. If you're confident in your body and how it looks, you don't need anybody's validation. The only, thing you should, the only thing you should worry is about your health. Because even if you're thin or you're fat, if you're not healthy, there's no point. Thank you. Thank you very much, contestants. All the very best to all the contestants. Thank you so much. All right, judges in a corpus army go to Karnamla. Our corpus army made the final decision like it in Irekim. So before that, we're continuing with the gala events. Other than that, we have arranged the food, not now, after some time. So uh, don't leave after the show. Over to Anoop and Anu for the gala events. Hello. Anu, Anu. 
Once again, we are going back to the Gala Awards. I know that you are all eagerly waiting for the winner of the uh, competition as well. But yes, I think we need to give some time to the judges to calculate and validate. I think it was a very, very difficult decision they are having. So I think let's give them some time. So in between, in the middle, uh, we'll have the awards going on. Uh, anu. Thank you, Anoop. Once again, a warm welcome to all of you. UAE National Day Gala Awards is given to those who excel in five categories, environment, philanthropy, business and innovation, community services, literature, and performing arts. And the National Day Awards and Cultural Night has been designed to be a refreshing and entertaining program, blending the sublime beauty of performing arts with thought-provoking intellectual experience. We will now have the Gala Literary Luminary Award. And the award for the year 2022 goes to Mr. John Samuel, Malayalam writer, storyteller, actor, and TV personality. May we request Mr. Shabu Sultan, Vice Chairman WMC Dubai, and Mrs. Tessie John, John Shari, Treasurer WMC Dubai Women's Forum, to accompany Mr. John Samuel to receive the Gala Literary Luminary Award for his exceptional contributions as a writer and storyteller. We request Dr. Isaac John, Ms. Nujum Al Ghanam and Adurji to be on the stage along with Mr. Shahul Hamid, President WMC Middle East and Mr. V.S. Bijakumar WMC and General Secretary Akaf. May we also have His Excellency Humayd bin Salim also on stage, please. We will watch a two minute video display of the awardee as he is ushered onto the stage. Shri John Samuel. Shri John Samuel, noted author, actor, and journalist who has been associated with journalism for the past 37 years and also has proven his worth in the fields of print and visual media, stage, and movies. He was a member of the Kerala Literature Academy. Shri John Samuel's notable works include Hallelujah, Amshabadi. Chida Basman, Nadori Kadagal, Calypso Cricket, and many more. He received the Kerala State Film Award for his write up on Adur Gopalakrishnan's Five Hero Characters. He has also received the P. Keshavadev Sahitya Award, Abu Dhabi Shakti Award, and many more awards. He started as a journalist 
worked for Akashavani and ended his career as a senior producer in Doordarshan. We welcome Sri John Samuel to receive the honors. He is now being presented with a bouquet by Ms. Lakshmi Lal. May we have Mr. Vinish Mohan on stage, please? We request Dr. Isaac John and Ms. Nujum, Ms. Nujum Al Ghanam to present the award to Mr. John Samuel. Dr. Isaac and Ms. Nujum presenting the award. <laughs> Mr. Vinesh Mohan will present him with a cash award. with the Ponada. Mr. Shahul Hamid can also join in. And Mr. Vichy Kumar. May we request Mr. John Samuel to kindly speak a few words to us. Friends, it gives me immense pleasure being today here for two reasons. First, of course, everybody knows this is the 51st anniversary of the, this nation. And the second one, I am, I have received this award in presence of Adul sir. This book is being given this prize. It is mainly concentrated on the five characters of Sri Adul Govalishan sir's films. In, in that film, in that book I have noted those five characters are very closely connected with his life, his native place, his surroundings, etc. So, if we could divide Sri Adur Govalakshan's soul into five, these five characters will represent his thinking. In other words, if these five characters are being brought together, it is three Adur Gobalations. And the thing is, this, this is written uh, in five parts, and it was published in a Malayalam weekly, and that got uh, last year's State Film Award for Best Writing on Cinema. Again, Gala has recognized this. I am, I am thankful to Gala, its president, Isaac John, then, of course, World Malayali Council. Thank you all. Thank you, Mr. John Samuel. Um, actually, we all had the privilege to listen to him earlier today, and he's not just an in inspiring writer, but he's an inspiring talker as well. Thank you so much, sir. Now, we will have um, Adu, sir, and Dr. Isaac John honor Mr. Shahul Hamid, uh, president of WMC Middle East, with the Ponyada for his valuable contributions.
Thank you, sir. Congratulations, Shahulka. Do you deserve it? And thank you so much. As Aduji and we request Mr. Dr. Isaac John to remain on stage. I'm requesting all other guests, uh, you may kindly uh, return to your seats. Thanks. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. No, sir. Uh, you you stay. You stay. Uh, you and Dr. J John, Isaac John. Sir, you have to stay. Yes, sir. Thank you, everyone. Now we are moving on to the 8th Gala Community Leadership Award. We have Gala Community Leadership Awards. There are four awardees in this category. First, we have Gala Community Leadership Award being presented to Mr. Johnny Kurula. Global Chairman of World Malayali Council for his lifetime contributions as a global community leader. Now, may we request Mr. Savan Kuti, President, WMC Sharjah Province, and Mr. Zakir Hussain from WMC Ajman Province to usher Mr. Joni Kurvila onto the stage. Now, may we also request Mr. C.U. Matai, Vice President, WMC Global, and Mr. Sandosh Ketet. General Secretary, WMC Middle East, to, to come on the stage. <laughs> now, can we have the video? Johnny Kurvila. Mr. Johnny Kurvila, entrepreneur and philanthropist, based in Dubai, UAE, and Muscat, Sultanate of Oman. Mr. Johnny Kurula is the founder and chairman of Johnny International Group of Companies. He carries on his first and foremost passion of the hotel industry as chairman of Johnny International Group of Companies, which looks after every area of hotel management according to the requirement of clients. His company does it with the highest standards. Johnny International Group extends from Abu Dhabi, Dubai, Ras Al Khaimah, and Oman. His business profile extends from trading, freight forwarding, facilities management, chemical supplies, hotel supplies, banquet tables, and banquet furniture to hotels in the Middle East and India, renter cars, travel and tours, logistics and trading companies. Mr. Johnny Kurvila holds distinguished positions in various fields to carry out his philanthropic activities. He is the governor of IESE, Abu Dhabi. He is the director of Rashtra Deepika Private Limited and patron for YMCA Kodalur Kotem District. He is also the founding director of Kanaya Catholic Cooperative Society in Kotem District, Kerala. For his services to the society, alongside recognition and many laurels, he has also been awarded with the highest civilian award by the UAE government in 2007 for his outstanding services to the GHQ of United Arab Emirates. During the same year, he was honored with the Kairli Award for his leadership and organizational skills. In August 2008, he was awarded with the Rajiv Gandhi Award by His Excellency K. Shankar Narayana, the Honorable Maharashtra Governor. He was honored with the Award of Excellence at World Malayali Council 2010 Global Conference at the 15th anniversary of WMC. Mr. Johnny Kurvila is also the Global Chairman of the World Malayali Council. We welcome Mr. Johnny Kurvila to receive the honours. Thank you and Mr. Johnny Kurvila is being presented with a bouquet by Ms. Danya Isaac. Now, we request Aduji to present the award to Mr. Johnny Kurvila. So, Gala Community Leadership Award goes to Mr. Johnny Kurvila, WMC Global Chairman. A big round of applause for him. Your own chairman, the global chairman. 
Thank you. And now we request Mr. Santosh and Mr. Mathai uh, to adorn him with the Purnada. And while we request all the guests to stay on, we request Mr. Johnny Kurula to say a few words to us. Yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> that was an excellent function. Proud to be part of this. Proud to be here on this auspicious day of UAE, where I completed 45 years. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for all this, what you gave to me. Thank you, Dr. Isaac Patani Parambal. It's an example. It's a, it's a, as he always says, thought-provoking leadership quality he shows here. Thank you all. Thank you so much, Mr. Johnny. The second Gala Community Leadership Award goes to Mr. Vargis Panakil, Chairman of Al Nasser Jewelry and Leader of World Malayali Council, which is being given in recognition of his lifetime contributions as a global community leader. We request Mr. Thomas Joseph, Chairman, WMC Dubai Province, and Mrs. Asha Charles, President, WMC Dubai Province, to usher Mr. Vargis Panikal on stage. We also request Mr. C.A. Biju, Secretary, WMC Middle East, and Mr. G.K. Rajiv, Treasurer, WMC Middle East, to be on stage. Could we have his video, please? Mr. Vergis Panikel, one of those few Indians who has witnessed the formation, transformation and growth of the United Arab Emirates. In January 1970, Mr. Vergis Panikel first set foot in UAE and began his career as a pharmacist. Quite soon, in 1979, Mr. Vergis Panikel, who always had a vision of being an entrepreneur, took his initial steps and established his first business venture, Al Nasa Pharmacy. Aspiring for more, he decided to try his luck in the jewelry sector. As right as rain, his business idea clicked and paved the way for the launch of Al Nasa Jewelry Group, which very soon became a popular name among the local and expat community in the region. As the saying goes, behind every successful man, there is a strong woman. With his pillar of strength, Mrs. Janet Burgess, he successfully established a network of businesses. Beating all odds, now Al Nasa Group is a popular enterprise which has operations both in UAE and India comprising of medical equipment and pharmaceutical supplies, jewelry, infrastructure and general trading. The proficient expertise of Mr. Vergis Panikel is perceiving the pulse of his customers is indeed the reason for the unprecedented success of his business ventures. Apart from being a successful businessman, Mr. Vergis Panikel is a, also an empathetic philanthropist who firmly believes in the ideology of supporting those who are in need and motivates the younger generation to be compassionate leaders. Mr. Vergis Panikel's relentless humanitarian efforts are prominent in the socio-cultural scenario. Being a visionary leader, he has held many distinguished positions at the WMC global, regional and provisional levels and was the former president of the Indian Social Centre Alain. Currently, he is pursuing the positions of WMC Global Advisory Board Member, WMC Alain Province President, 
Alain's Lion Club President, Core Committee Member of the Indian Social Centre Alain, President of St. Mary's Catholic Association and other key roles in the society. For his philanthropic service and business excellence, Mr. Vergis Panikel has been awarded with an array of laurels and awards like the Kairali Business Excellence Award, WMC Lifetime Achievement Award and many more. As an ardent traveller, he has visited and explored the opportunities in more than 80 countries around the world. Therefore, Mr. Vergis Panikel, always accompanied by his better half, Mrs. Janet Vergis, sets an excellent example of how to strike a balance between a successful professional and personal life and how to be of service to humankind. Let's welcome Mr. Vergis Panikel to receive the honors. Mr. Vergis Panikel is being presented with a bouquet by Mrs. Rani Sudhir. May we request Adurji and His Excellency Humayd bin Salim to give away the award to Mr. Varghese Panakal. Mr. C.A. Biju and Mr. G.K. Rajiv to adorn the Panada. We request Mr. Vargis Panakal to speak a few words to us. Good evening. Today, I get to the Gela International Award from here. I am very much Thankful to the Gala Committee to elect me such a award. I am very grateful and I am not going to tell anymore. I am here living last 53 years in UAE. I got such a big award. I am not eligible for that even though I got it. I will continue my life here itself and I will do what I can do for the community. I have promised, I am thanking you, all of you, and my congratulations and best wishes for the 50th first anniversary of UAE. Thanking you, not to speak anymore. Thanks once for all of you. Thank you so much, Mr. Varghis Panikal. Thank you. We request Adulji to kindly remain on stage. And His Excellency, Pumed Bin Sal. Okay. Now we go into the 10th award and the third of the Gala Community Leadership Award. And it goes to Sunni Kulatakal, Global President of the Global Organization of People of Indian Origin, Gopio, for his lifetime contributions as a community leader. May we request Mrs. Bindu Babu from Ajman WC province, WMC province and Mr. Lal Bhaskar, Secretary WMC Dubai province to usher Mr. Sunni Kulatakal on stage. We also request... We also request Joe Joseph, a very big businessman from Abu Dhabi and uh, Dr. Paul Poteril, Father Paul Poteril, to please come on to the stage. And also Ignatius Mohan, President of WMC Umelkoyen Place. Ignatius. Can we have the video, please? Mr. 
Mr. Sunny Kolothakar, renowned journalist and incumbent president of the Global Organization for the People of Indian Origin. His first entry to the Gulf in 1979 was to carry out an assignment for a leading publication, the Illustrated Weekly of India. He was one of the first to witness and study the condition of the expatriates who lived and worked through challenging conditions. While working on improving the conditions of the NRIs, Mr. Sunny and his wife, Mrs. Elizabeth, have nurtured Sunless Publication House across the Middle East. He worked alongside the expatriate community in creating better lifestyles and opportunities for them through an exercise of networking and collaboration. Mr. Sunny Kulathakar is also an accomplished author. His Malayalam work on the vices that grip the modern society was an eye-opener and a shocking revelation of the grimy underbelly of a society that needed correction right from the roots. He has also, to his credit, a biography of Martin Luther King and an epic book, Karl Pardubal, which comprises of collection of interviews published in various newspapers. Mr. Sunny Kulathakar played a pivotal role in shaping the Indian diaspora in the Gulf into a well-knit family. Mr. Sunny created the Gulf's Who is Who directory and continues updating the scene. His work was lauded by the Crown Prince and the first Deputy Prime Minister, His Highness Salman bin Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa and urged Mr. Sunny to update the directory with views from maximum people in the region. Every once in a while, an individual is born who by his sheer energy and enthusiasm shakes up the world and influences thousands of others to wake up, take note and act. Mr. Sunny Kolatakal is one such individual. Let's welcome Mr. Sunny Kolatakal to receive the honors. Now, Mr. Sunny is being presented with a bouquet by Ms. Preetha Jacob. Oh, sorry, Danya Isaac. Now, may we request uh, His Excellency Humayd bin Salam and Adurji to give away the award to Mr. Sunny. Thank you, sir. And now we request uh, Father Paul Puatungal and Mr. Ignatius to adorn him with the ponada. And Mr. Joe Joseph. Okay. Now, uh, may I have a few words from you, sir? Thank you. At the outset, I want to congratulate my longtime friend, uh, Dr. Isaac John, and uh, his team to organize such a wonderful program. And uh, Isaac is my old friend, means uh, before his wife, Prabha, met him, uh, my wife and myself met Isaac years back, and we worked together for a lot of publication work, and I had my Gulf Asian magazine, Gulf Directory, everything. And he is there with me for a long time, and now he is uh, as a global president of Gopio. He is also with me as a global ambassador, and uh, I really appreciate what he is doing. And this is very unexpected, even such a big program. I, in my life, I will never, sort of, I have not run after money and award, I feel that it is like running after the butterfly. If the butterfly wants, it will come and sit on your lap. And I feel that this is a very unexpected thing. And I never, 2004, Saru, former Saru, IK, Saru, uh, Saru. Prime Minister IK Gujaral gave me one award through the Gopio. And this is a very, very rare opportunity. I thank you very much for wonderful thing, Dr. Isaac. And I've received it from our 
Uh, Adurji means it is something very marvelous, and I, I always remember. Thank you very much with all the VAPs presence. Thank you very much. Thank you, Thank you so much, Mr. Sunny. Uh, now, may we request uh, Dr. Isaac John and Adurji to adorn Mr. Joe Joseph with a ponada. Thank you so much. That's perfect. Thank you. Thank you so much. Now we have we have we have a someone who's uh, not just he's little different from us. He's a priest, but um, he is known as a singing priest. So, um, he is very famous all across Kerala and possibly he, you, some of them at least you might have heard him. So, we have a special request, Father Paul Povathingal. Now, we want a song from you. So, I'll be going to. I'll be singing a song from movie Bobby, sung by Shailendra Singh. Mishai to nai Mishai to nai Magai ye haseen Jab se dekha Mainne tujko mujko Shairi a gai Mishai to nahi magar ye hasi jab se dekha maine tujko mujko shayari a gayi main aashiq to nahi magar ye hasi jab se dekha मैंने तुझको मुझको आशिकी आ गई मिशाय तो नहीं प्यार का नाम मैंने सुना था मगर प्यार क्या है ये मुझको नहीं थी कबर प्यार का नाम मैंने सुना था मगर प्यार क्या है ये मुझको नहीं थी कबर मैं तो उलझा रहा उलझा दो की इतहा दोस्तों में रहा दुश्मनों की तरह मैं दुश्मन तो नहीं मैं दुश्मन तो नहीं मगर ये हसी जब से देखा 
मैंने तुझको मुझको दोस्ती आ गई मिशाय तो नहीं सोचता हूँ अगर मैं हुआ मांगता हाथ अपने उड़ा कर मैं क्या मांगता सोचता हूँ अगर मैं हुआ मांगता हाथ अपने उड़ा कर मैं क्या मांगता जब से तुझसे मुहबत में करने लगा तब से जैसे ही बादल में करने लगा मैं गा फिर तो नहीं मैं गा फिर तो नहीं मगर ये हसी जब से देखा मैंने तुझको मुझको बंदगी आ गई मिशाए तो नहीं मगर ये हसी जब से देखा मैंने तुझको मुझको शायरी आ गई मिशाए तो नहीं थैंक यू थैंक यू वेरी मच wasn't that so mesmerizing thank you so much father and now for the last but not the least we have the fourth gala community leadership award and that goes to our very own mr charles paul president all kerala colleges alumni forum for his lifetime contributions to social and humanitarian causes we request mr soni lal from wnc alain province and mr jain varaketil vice president wmc middle east to usher mr charles paul on stage we also request john shari of dubai province kp vision of ajman province and ajit kumar secretary sharja province to come on stage I also request P.K. Sajid Kumar and Chako Ulakaran, who is the uh, advisory board chairman and leader of World Trade Council, to be on the stage. Chako Ulakaran and Sajid P.K. Sajid Kumar. Could we have a short video on Mr. Charles Paul, please? <laughs> All Kerala Colleges Alumni Forum (ACAF) was formed in 1998 in Dubai under the joint initiatives of Dr. Isaac John Patani Parambal and his friends, with the main objective as to organize events and programs for the Indian community at large and for college friends from across Kerala. In a sense, ACAF seeks to recreate the campus memories of a nostalgic past and celebrate the spirit of camaraderie and common aspiration of former students from some 160 colleges in Kerala. It has been one of the most dynamic socio-cultural organizations of the UAE ever since its inception and seeks to celebrate the enduring strong relationship between UAE and India. One of its missions is to organize cultural and social events and enhance bonding between the people of both the nations. ACAF's activities across various areas are led by prominent personalities from different walks of life. ACAF was the co-organizer of the Flower of Tolerance for the Ministry of Tolerance held in 2019 as a part of the National Festival of Tolerance and Human Fraternity 2019. 
The event was under the patronage of His Excellency Sheikh Nahyan bin Mubarak Al Nahyan, the Minister of Tolerance of the UAE, and made an entry into the Guinness Book of World Records. Akaf UAE is a registered and a legal entity in the UAE to conduct events and programs. Akaf boasts having the large Facebook alumni group, having 70,000 plus members. They also have the Akaf Ladies Way. Akaf Toastmasters Club, Akaf Children's Club, Akaf Task Force, Akaf Social and Media Group, Akaf Careers Group as their subsidiary forums. Akaf is also involved with various philanthropic food activities such as blood donation, food donations, health camps, etc. We welcome Akaf officials to receive the honors. Mr. Charles Paul is being presented with a bouquet by Joshila Shabu. Award I know. We request Adorji and His Excellency Humayd bin Salam to give away the award to Mr. Charles Paul. We also request. Mr. John Shari, Ajit Kumar, and K.P. Vijayan to adorn the punada on Mr. Charles Paul. Charles Paul to speak a few words to us. A very warm good evening to the distinguished personalities, ladies and gentlemen. Today, as you know, uh, which marks the 51st National Day of UAE, on behalf of ACAF, I salute the visionary leaders of this country. for their selfless and tireless support for steering up this nation to enviable heights for receiving this award is an auspicious moment for akaf akaf popularly known as all kerala college of alumni forum which is established in 1998 is an apex body of about 150 plus active college alumni from kerala it is one of the largest non profit non political socio professional organization in the middle east the members of akaf includes prominent business personalities professionals from leading business organizations uh, various industrial and corporate segments also social activists we are working with one mantra passion to serve which uh, makes akaf an organization for the people i truly uh, i truly de uh, dedicate this award to the ende rakka family this couldn't have been possible without their wholehearted support and the team work i have to mention a few leaders of akaf our chairman sri shahul hamid our general secretary sri vs bijukumar our treasurer sri judin fernandez our chief coordinator Sri Anubhanil Devan and the vibrant ladies wing officials chair chairperson Rani Sudhir president Anu Pramod general secretary Vidya Budhisheri the list is too long because of the time constraints i will have to make it short anyway this uh, akaf this uh, this uh, award have uh, we truly uh, this uh, help to do more things in the future this is a catalyst which act as a catalyst for me and the entire akka family to do more and more great things and contributions in the future once again i thank the entire gala family for this award and uh, i express my deep gratitude to them and also 
to the, especially to the Dr. Isaac John Patani Parambil, the great visionary leader. Once again, thank you so much and wishing you all a great, good uh, program and a, a, a good evening. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mr. Charles. Now, uh, we have one more honoring remaining. So, um, may I request uh, His Excellency Humayat Ben Salam and uh, Adurji to uh, Adonai Panada for Mr. Chako Olakarden, uh, WMC member. And uh, let me also request Mr. Isaac John to join with them. Thank you. And also Mr. F Mr. Sajid Kumar, T.S. Sajid Kumar to join uh, the honoring along with the distinguished guests. Please, please put your hands up. Hands up. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much, distinguished guests. And uh, that's it. And with it. that, we come to the end of the award ceremony. We May request all of you to stand up and applaud all these great achievers. We have 11 of them and a lot more uh, honors gone their way. So we need to stand and give them a big round of applause. Thank you so much once again. Gala Awards will come back, but until then, we are passing our, uh, you know, the mic to the finalists and their team, so that you'll know who's the winner. Enjoy. Thank you so much. May I request Nisha to come out to the stage and take over the stage, please? Yeah. And uh, one more reminder, the food, food is almost ready. So, uh, you know, if you want the results, stay back. So, and then you can uh, join the food queue. Nisha, over to you. Good evening once again. We are moving on to the results part. Adri Mumbai can I have all the all the contestants on the stage, please? A huge round of applause to the contestants. Our dear effort in them, other than that. It's a 
ഇവിടെ ഉണ്ടായിരുന്ന നമ്മുടെ കോറിയോഗ്രാഫറിനെ ഒക്കെ വേദിയിലേക്ക് ക്ഷണിക്കേണ്ട ഒരു സമയമാണ് മാൻ വൈറ്റ് മിസ് സിമി മോൾ റേജോ ദ കോറിയോഗ്രാഫർ ഓൺ ടു ദ സ്റ്റേജ് And Mr. Zulfi, can I have you on the stage? Mr. Zulfi? All right. Namalini. ഇന്ന് ഇവിടെ മാറ്റുരച്ച എല്ലാ കണ്ടസ്റ്റൻസിനും പാർട്ടിസിപ്പേഷൻ സർട്ടിഫിക്കറ്റ് നൽകുന്ന ഒരു ചടങ്ങിലേക്ക് കടക്കുകയാണ് ഐ ഇൻവൈറ്റ് മിസ്റ്റർ സന്തോഷ് വർഗീസ് മാനേജിംഗ് ഡയറക്ടർ ഓഫ് കിയോക്സിയ ടു പ്രസിഡന്റ് ദ പാർട്ടിസിപ്പേഷൻ സർട്ടിഫിക്കറ്റ്സ് ടു ദി കണ്ടസ്റ്റൻസ് Mr. Santosh Vargis Can I have a Sharjah Province President Sri Shravan Kuti on the stage please contestant vrinda pradeep inviting vrinda pradeep to receive your certificate of participation ms vinaya reji ms sri lakshmi k r Ms. Preeti Kaatur Ms. Prayaga John Ms. Parvati Anil Kumar Thank you very much Sri Santosh Vargis thank you for your time thank you very much baaki certificates kodukkunnadinai sri shravan kuti adeyathine shenikunu contestant noor jahan risham miss noor jahan miss julia maryam vijobi miss julia maryam miss gopika babu Ms. Elizabeth Jacob Thank you very much Sri Shravan Kuti sir Namade show coordinator Sri Zulfi Akshanikunu baaki certificates nalgunadinai Ms. Adira Murli Arindati Ms Arindati Ms Anisha Nishan Ms Anisha and Ms Aishwarya Vinu Ningal olinjo nokkunnundo end result like Thank you so much. Poor the Namkini Baki Sadangal Lake Gudi Karakana and I request you to kindly stay back. And Namala winners like a Pona in a moon biter. Winner, first runner up, second runner up, like a Pona in a moon biter. Namka got his subtitles announced the end of the night under. At the moon biter, I request Miss Esther Isaac, Miss Joshla Shabu, Miss Bindu Babu, Miss 
Rani Lijesh and Ms. Smita Jain to kindly join us onto the stage. Karcha samay theke naamal naamal party se bensne ondo marakki ana to. I request all the judges to kindly join us, Mr. Vivek Menon, cinematographer, Ms. Namrata Prakash, Mrs. Kerala 2021, Ms. Shruti uh, Shri Tulasi, Ms. Kerala 2008, Dr. Smita Prabhakar, entrepreneur and International Women's Excellence Awardee. Requesting retired Lieutenant Colonel in Indian Army, Miss Beshli Shyam, to kindly join us on the stage. I also request Dr. Paula Rodriguez to kindly join us on the stage. Can I have Mrs. Suramya Santosh Vargis from Kyoxia on the stage, please? Ms. Suramya Santosh Vargis. I request Ms. Maggie, Secretary of Rotary Club, to join us. Ms. Maggie, Secretary of Rotary Club, I request you to kindly join us. Yes, we are judges very good at this point. We are very good at this point. We are very good at this point. Can I have... Yes, Smitha ma'am, please a few words. Good evening everyone. Hope everyone has enjoyed. How is everyone doing today? We are as excited as you are, waiting for the results, and we had a tough time. Our brains were scrambled. We didn't even know in the first few contestants, which was a tough competition. We had, uh, we had to have literally many discussions to even come to arrive. And I think uh, the organization has done an amazing day. WMC has done a phenomenal job. And what I've seen is here, the way they are coordinating, the togetherness, and each and every one of you, Supporting each other has made it so phenomenally amazing. And Sami and yourself, like you, done an amazing job. And I've seen them like really in the groundwork. And I, I think they deserve a huge round of applause. And Mr. Isaac John and his wife and the complete team. And I mean, they've done been phenomenal. They took care of us, all of us, all the three judges and they were amazing and phenomenal and um, we had a great time and I'm sure you will as well after the results come. I mean, you will be very happy to hear that and we did our best and thank you for supporting the, the whole event and thank you for being there patiently for such a long time. I know it's a hard time, but great. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. As I mentioned earlier, Dr. Paula Rodriguez, she is a fashion designer, she is a health consultant, and moreover, she is the mother of eight children. <laughs> Can we know what is your secret of your beauty? Oh, thank you for considering me, yes? Yes, I'm a mother of eight, and I think the most important thing you can do for your health is sleep well, eight hours, please at least, um, exercise 20 minutes daily, um, drink lots of water, and come to my clinic. <laughs> yes, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you very much, ma'am. And the most awaited results. It's time to announce the results. 
But before moving on to the results, as I mentioned, we are moving on to the subtitles first. Okay, that's great. Um, we have a video presentation of Dr. Paula Rodriguez. Can I have the video, please? Paula Rodriguez, a Colombian-born Emirati national who has been living in this country for more than two decades. A graduate from the University of Maryland in the United States and having worked before in several prominent positions, discovered her passion for aesthetics which led her to steer the cosmetic industry leaders in setting up clinics and hospitals, which led to the establishment of Emiratans LLC, a company that bridges the cosmetic and healthcare markets. Emiratens is one of the most highly recognized entities when it comes to attracting top talent from Latin American countries such as Colombia and Brazil and bringing the best of talent to the United Arab Emirates. She is also an active figure on social media and a frequent speaker on the subject, the cultural beauty of both the Arab and the Latin world. Let's welcome Miss Paula Rodriguez. That is a wonderful video presentation about Dr. Paula. A huge round of applause to her. Thank you so much, ma'am, for being here. We are really honored to have you here. So, yes, conditions, please, you may come back to your positions. Okay, done? All right. And moving on to the subtitles, the first award category is Miss Talent. We have a lot of talent around the grooming session. That's why we have a lot of talent. And Miss Talent is none other than Miss Preeti Kator. A huge round of applause to Miss Preeti Kator. Preeti, please come to the train a little forward. I request Ms. Simimol Rejo. Ms. Simimol Rejo, Sashe Nalganadanai, Simimol Ne Shenikino. And the Miss Talent is Preeti Kator. A huge round of applause to Preeti Kator once again. Congratulations, Preeti. Same by me, the Mura Namka or talent round to Munbana Sangar Pichu and Aranda Adela Valare Manohara Maita or seen Abine Chikaniki Erno Pridhi Shayda. Congratulations, Pridhi. And the next awarding category is Miss Shining Star. The award goes to Miss Arunthati Lal. Congratulations, Arunthati. I request Miss Simimol Rejo to present the sashay once again to Miss Arunthati Lal. Congratulations. She is an excellent singer. Miss Shining Star is Miss Arunthati Lal. And the next category is Miss Vivicious. And the winner is Parvati Anil Kumar. Parvati, congratulations. She is Miss Vivicious of the show. I request Miss Namrita Prakash to kindly come forward. Sasha Nikindunai. And the title Miss Vivicious is to Parvati Anil Kumar. Congratulations, Parvati. A huge round of applause to Parvati Anil Kumar. She is a mechanical engineer. Now, moving on to the next subtitle, Miss Congeniality. And the award goes to Anisha Nishant. Congratulations, Anisha. I request Miss Sritha Lassi to kindly come forward. Sasha Nikhilavinai.
ഒരു നിറഞ്ഞ കൈയടി മിസ് അനീഷ നിശാന്തിനു താങ്ക് യു ശ്രീ തുളസി The next up title is Miss Ram Walk. Ram Walk is the most popular performance in the world. Gopika Babu. Congratulations, Gopika. Dr. Smitha Prabhagar, I'm going to introduce you to Sasha. Thank you. Congratulations, Gopika. Ms. Rambok is Gopika Babu. It's time to announce Ms. Bodhi Beautiful. And the prize goes to Julia Mariam Vijobi. Julia, congratulations. Requesting Mr. Vivek Menon to kindly come forward. Sasha Rikinu Dhanai, Mr. Vivek Menon Rikshu Rikinu. Congratulations Miss Bodhi Beautiful Julia Mariam Vijobi And the last subtitle Miss Fashion Icon goes to Priyaga John Priyaga congratulations She is the fashion icon of the event I request Ms. Beshli Shyam to come forward, please. Sasha Anikina Dhanai. The subtitles are over. It's time to announce the winners. The winner, first runner-up and second runner-up. Let's stand at the third runner-up. Let's go to the second runner-up, which is the third prize. I request Ms. Maggie, Secretary of Rotary Club, to kindly come forward for crowning the second runner-up. And the second runner up is nokkirudu <laughs> and the second runner up is any guesses no a chundi kanikunnunde korcha aalkare okay and the second runner up is none other than vrinda pradeep congratulations vrinda requesting Miss Maggie, the secretary of Rotary Club, to crown. A huge round of applause to Brinda Pradeep for procuring the third runner-up prize. Congratulations, Vrinda. Moving on to the first runner-up. Yeah, I don't know why. I don't know why. So, we are moving on to... I don't know. If you have any contestants, you have any guesses? Any wild guesses? Any wild guesses? If you have two names, you have to hear. Okay, I have to hear. Any guesses? Contestant number is not the name of the name. There are two names. Two names. Anyone else? 
seven, two, kore, 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 where is it? And, huh? Yeah, one to fourteen, but you know. And the first runner-up is Elizabeth Jacob. Congratulations! Requesting Mrs. Suramya Santosh Vargis from Kyoxia to do the crowning. A huge round of applause to. Miss Elizabeth Jacob. Or a Naranya Kaidi, a huge round of applause to Elizabeth. Time to announce World Malayali Queen, the name of the World Malayali Queen 2022. And <laughs> yes, it's none other than Aishwarya Vina. <laughs> World Malayali Queen of 2022 inviting Dr. Paula Rodriguez to do the crowning. Ladies and gentlemen, a huge round of applause. Miss Aishwarya Amino, Miss Elizabeth Jacob, and Miss Brenda Prady. Thank you very much. I request all the dignitaries to kindly be seated. Requesting the judges, judges, please remain on the stage. Judges, please remain on the stage. I request you to kindly remain on the stage.
Requesting our judges to stay back on the stage, please. Simi and Zulfi, can I have you both on the stage, please? Requesting the judges and the choreographer and the show director to stay back on the stage. May I invite Dr. Isaac John Patani Parambil? Gala Chairman, Dr. Isaac John Patani Parambil to kindly join us on the stage, please. Contestants, I request you to kindly pose for the photographs. May I invite Dr. Isaac John Patani Parambil, Gala Chairman, to kindly come to the stage. Thank you for a wonderful evening. For the participants, it was a marvelous, what, what do you call a scintillating performance by every one of you. You all deserve first prize, but unfortunately, only there are only three prizes. But the most important part of the thing is this part, you know, where we are going to honor the key people behind the grooming sessions. They could not have performed without the support of Simimol and uh, Sulfi. Sulfi, they are all uh, supposed to be, or they are all well known in the fashion field. And they have been in this field. They have made their mark, reputation. And I invite Hussein al Jafri and uh, Belsala and Maggie to come on the stage to honor them because you know it is because of this phenomenal show was made so special so beautiful so eye-catching because of these two people Simimol and uh, Sulfi we give them a big round of applause please so, come. and uh, thank you judges for your great support and uh, your professionalism these are the judges, you know, they have done it. And uh, now, please. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, she's a good orator also. <laughs> Thank you. Ah. Uh, uh, Belsa, Amat, Amat, you know him, my, her, my wife. <laughs> okay, now, we are coming to the, we are going to honor. So I request, uh, Ahmad and uh, Al Jazeera to give away the award to Simi Mall. Simi Mall. Both of you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I request Magrita, Maggie, Maggie to do the next round of honors. Honor Sulfi. Sulfi, he is the architect of this beautiful show. Please, Sulfi, and uh, all of you will be, uh, Maggie will be handing it over with the, with the support of both of you. You all three, give, oh no, you also join. Give, the, give him a big round of applause, please, Sulfi. <laughs> he has done a very beautiful show last week at uh, Shagrila. It was so eye-catching, you know, so beautiful. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Class, class, class. Where is my cash award? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so we, are, we, are, we have come to a conclusion. Huh? Okay, uh, get just. And see, you have done a very beautiful job, and uh, uh, and also, you know, it was it came to a such a beautiful ending, and you have done pakka professionalism in your judgment because you know the job. Otherwise, I would have been a judge, you know, because I don't know <laughs> about all these things. And thank you very much. And are they going to be acknowledged in any way? Yeah. 
Yeah. I request Mr. Isaac John Patani Parambil to kindly present our gift to Mr. Vivek Menon. Thank you, Smita. Thank you, Ms. Smita, for being here. Ms. Namrita Prakash. Ms. Sri Tulasi. Once again, thank you so much, judges. Mr. Vivek Menon, cinematographer. Ms. Smita. Ms. Uh, Ms. Jeetalasi and Ms. Namrita Prakash, I request you to kindly step forward. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, judges. Please uh, collect your coupons and proceed to the dinner. Please contact Mr. Biju, Mr. C. A. Biju. Hello, hello everyone. We missed a very important announcement. See this, the winner of this beauty pageant is going to get an Indigo ticket, return ticket and three days, sorry, four days stay at a beautiful resort in Kovalam. Plus, can you guess a chance to act in one of the films, which is going to be made soon. So. Where is she? Where is the winner? Uh, yeah. Yeah? So, so also Ontario is also giving her a lift. So please come on to the stage. Indigo ticket is going to be issued now. Indigo people, you are here? Linden? Aishiria. You are going to come, come, come on to the stage. Yeah? Uh. Eh? Okay, come, 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 please, please. Indigo's officials are here. They are going, handing over this ticket to the uh, ticket to the World Malayali Kuhn. So, yeah, yeah. please, please hand it over to him. Yeah. yeah. So this is a ticket, Indigo ticket, to any destinations in India. Plus, you are going to get a coupon for four days stay at Kovalam Somadiram. Plus, a chance to act in a film, huh? which is going to be produced by AVA Productions. Anu, huh? okay. Congratulations. Now. The runner up. Thank you. Runner up. Ah, okay, Elizabeth. Ah, Elizabeth. Congratulations, Mole. Congratulations. And you are going to get a ticket round trip and a three day stay at Kovala uh, Somadiram Resort, plus a chance to act in a film. Okay, congratulations once again. Thank you. Second runner up, please come on to the stage. So you are going to get a gift uh, to two days stay at a Kovalam Resort, Somadhiram, plus a chance to act in a film, plus a cash award. What, what is that? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
ओके कंग्रेचुलेशन वन सेकेंड कंग्रेचुलेशन सो सो द फिल्म थिंग यू विल हैव टू यू विल हैव टू सबमिट योर प्रोफाइल फोटोज एवरीथिंग बिफोर डिसंबर फिफ्टींथ कैन यू हियर मी ऑल दी विनर्स युअर युअर प्रोफाइल युअर वीडियो एंड other uh, uh, testimonials to be given to the production house before december 15 yeah yeah so finished okay santosh tanvir koi so who who is the winner of toshiba quiz Arun George and the winner for the FIFA Toshiba FIFA memories is Arun George this is the original tell me this is the original match football for FIFA 22 which is being played in Qatar uh, i'm so glad to receive this uh, ball this ball is called the uh, al riala it means the journey and um, i have a connection with uh, toshiba when i was uh, started to when i was started to um, like using the laptops when um, in in 2004 when i was going to purchase my first laptop uh, the only thing that i looked in the internet was who made the first laptop so the answer was toshiba toshiba made the first laptop in 1995 it's called the toshiba t1100 am i right sir yeah so thank you very much for uh, giving me this award i appreciate it thank you thank you thank you thank you so much dignitaries so almost your event is avasanichirikkana i once again request you to kindly collect your coupons and proceed to the dinner hall to have your dinner UAE National Day Awards and Cultural Night by World Malayali Council and Middle East Region Women's Forum Lola World Malayali Queen is ending here thank you so much everyone for all your support and kind cooperation see you all in the next event till then this is Nisha yourself signing off good night